What's up everybody, Typical Gamer with your daily YouTube live streams and more. And today for you, I have the continuation of the Days Gone walkthrough. If you don't know what this game is about, you're going to be in for a real treat. This zombie apocalypse travel game that's really, really awesome. And uh, absolutely a lot of fun. And you guys have been enjoying it well uh, as well. I mean, every video that I've done that's not Days Gone, I've had everybody going, where's Days Gone? When's Days Gone going to be? So Days Gone's here and uh, we're going to be playing it. Uh... Where we left off last episode was pretty crazy, so I'm very interested to see where this story uh, takes off from here. So if you watch and enjoy this, you want to see Days Gone more frequently, hit that like button for me real quick. I've never set a like goal on the series. I'm curious, as a team, what we can do. Let's see if we can get 10,000 likes, and if you're new around here, make sure to hit that subscribe button as well. Finally, the glasses are back in stock at typical dot stores. If you want to go cop them, they are available now so uh we got three different missions here we got uh without being seen prepare to attack the ripper compound we have uh you won't be needing this find detonation cords uh in schizo's cabin and then we have like your new digs uh taunt schizo so we're gonna start off with the side mission here and see what it kind of takes us because uh yeah Schiz schizo's be a, a real pain and um if we can taunt him at all i'll be happy to so let's head over to his cabin and let's see what the game gonna get us to do here in this zombie the zombie apocalypse where is this cabin anyway oh that's his cabin oh he's not gonna let me want? in hey bro can i come in schizo said it's cool no okay well there's that i'm just gonna go ahead and go around me through a back window maybe just hey schizo How's it going in there? Oh. You like your new digs? Deke? Deke? Talk to me, brother. You know why I did it. First of all, I ain't your brother. And yeah, I do know why you did it. Oh, Deke! Come on, damn it! It wasn't personal. You gotta know that. There was no other way. Talk to Iron Mike, please. You tell him. Tell him I was just trying to save the camp. That's all I ever wanted. Oh, I'm gonna talk to Iron Mike. As soon as they find your ass guilty, I'm asking him to give you to me. Come midnight, me and Boozer, we're gonna tie you up. We're gonna put you in the middle of the highway, and we're gonna wait for a horde. Deke, you gotta listen to me, brother! What do you suppose that feels like, huh? Torn apart? Eaten alive? Deke, I was just trying to stop Carlos. Stop the Rippers, and keep this camp safe! This is our life, Deke! You know what? I think we're going to do that whether they find you guilty or not. Goodbye, Schizo. That was that was pretty mean, not going to lie, but screw Schizo. Deke. I don't like him. Dick! Damn it, listen to me, Dick. I'm sorry, brother. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I didn't want to do it, but I had to. Shut up. I... All right? Shut up. All right, let's find the detonation cord. Be quiet. He literally gave us up to Carlos. Like, I don't want to hear it. The dead cord. Schizo's so, uh, cabin. Let's see what you got, we were we're just going to head into Schizo's cabin. Nobody's guarding that. Oh, he looks like he lives a good life. How do I ever trust this asshole? Our hand is not doing so hot, is it? Hello. Oh, no way I get to keep that. Guess Skizzit won't be needing this. It looks like we got a sniper. Ooh, sweet. All right, let's get on out of here. What is this? Uh, oh, okay. So we got a special sniper now. No ammo in it, though. So we got to go over to this spot here. I was wondering if we should. Should we try out the sniper? I want to try out the sniper. Gosh, they did burn down a couple of spots. I mean, they roughed, they roughed up the place. They roughed up the place a little bit. So I'm going to go get ammo for the sniper. I'm excited that we got it. Let's put a silencer on it too. There we go. That's a fat silencer on it. Let me tell you that. It's a real fat silencer. And let's head over here and get ammo for it. Because I don't think we have much ammo. For that, at least. 
I've never seen anyone drive a car in this game. You guys realize that? It's all motorcycles. Hey, how's it going, dude? I'm not gonna turn that Joseph, in here. Joseph, world's best bounty collector. Joseph. Supplies. 400 yep. credits for that. All right. Okay. We're gonna do it. Deke, take care now. Uh, let's ride our bike up there. I don't want to use my legs anymore. Wait, how far is my bike? Oh, my bike's over there. Okay, we're just going to go to this mission because hopefully it'll reset and uh, bring our bike a little bit closer to us. Just just a little bit, all right? Wordo World and Sin of Greed. Thank you both for becoming members and welcome to Leet. Enjoy those emotes. If you want to join as well, link will be in the description below. All right, let's head up here. And I think we got to talk to Iron Mike. Oh. It's down low. It's down low. I'm here. Now I just gotta get this back to my cabin with no one seeing me. Great. Is this a sneak mission? Is this a sneak mission? Let's see. Great. Look, I'm just trying to take down the Rippers. No biggie. Just trying to... I feel like nobody's actually... Nobody actually cares that much about what just happened to their village, man. I'd be so upset. Wouldn't everybody want the, the freaking Rippers gone? They, like, carved four people out. They literally carved somebody. Like a turkey. Leaving mission zone, what? No, I'm good. I went the uh, I went the route that uh that I thought nobody would be. Apparently that's the long way around. That's okay. Hordes are a migratory group of freaks. Alright. Oh we oh we own this place now. That's nice. That's nice. Alright. Um it really took away my my thing, huh? I really just got a sniper now. I just got to work with it. Alright, let's head over here. A little bit of preparation. Oh, we're going to get back at Carlos. We got a little bit of history, me and Carlos. Typical James, thanks for becoming a member as well. Welcome to Elite. Enjoy those emotes, man. If you want to join as well, link in the description below. It's okay, I'm fine. What's going on? I'm a goddamn veterinarian. I went to school to cure colic and heaves and hoof disease. Does this look like a fucking hoof to you? Addy, no, Addy. you saw what happened to Boozer. I can't do this. Hey, There's so many wounded. Addy. And so many dying. Addy. Deacon, I am not a doctor. Okay, maybe not. But you're all we've got. <laughs> She's gonna make freaking lose it. Yeah, that burn did not look good. I mean, I guess it was less severe than than Boozer's because we didn't have to lose the arm, but... So, Addy's not a doctor. Huh. Okay, so you're not a doctor. You still <laughs> saved Boozer's life. <laughs> she saved That's his life. She's not a doctor. Something. That's nuts. We thought she was a doctor this whole time, for real. Hey, Deke. So I want to go check on the explosives to make sure, you know, the Rippers didn't steal them. And then I went to Schizo's cabin to check on the deck cords. But I should have just come straight here and saved some time. Get the hell out of here, Ricky. Guess we can go blow up that cave, right? I'll come with you. <sighs> when I was a kid, <laughs> my dad found a rat's nest underneath one of our sheds. You want to know what he did? Can't even guess. Well, I waited till morning. They'd all be asleep. He laid a piece of plywood over the hole and told me to go get the garden hose. And he said to me, I never forget what he said to me. He said the best way to kill a rat's nest is to drown him. You can blow up the reservoir above the camp? Oh, that's an idea. Deacon, you can't. They want to rest in De peace, I'm going to help them out. Deacon, you can't do that. Why is that? Because Iron Mike? 
because of some fucking treaty. You know, I want to cut Schizo's throat, but he's right about one thing. Carlos ain't gonna stop, Rippers ain't gonna stop, and you know it. Are you sure this isn't personal? Fuck yeah, it's personal. <laughs> I love Deacon. tried burning my arm off you'd be upset too lady ricky boozer i'm heading to the gate you ready way ahead of you brother Ooh. okay i'm almost there let's go booze man please tell me we actually get to do it nice rifle Oh, yeah, a little present from Schizo. Remind me to be there when you give it back to him. He'll be there. <laughs> we got some dynamite. We're ready to go. Blow up some, some dudes. Some blow up some rippers. Oh, we got a... Where is this? Oh, my, we got a rider right into their territory. Oh, snap. Okay, so this is where the water reservoir is. This is where their camp is. <laughs> uh, honestly, he has a great idea. That goddamn schizo. So what are we going to do with the bastard? I mean, we're not letting Iron Mike put him on trial, are we? No, we're not. All right, so what's the plan? I know the area pretty well. Sarah, uh... Worked out of a lab south of Iron Butte Ranch. I used to ride out there, pick her up for lunch. Harder to ride on some of those back roads. Jesse, Carlos, whatever the hell he's calling himself. He's taken over the old golf course and resort. Just south of the lodge is the Crescent Lake Reservoir. Now we blow that dam, that lake's gonna flood down into the valley and it's gonna drown them all, like rats. Ooh. Okay, but isn't the lodge up on a hill? Yeah, yeah, flood probably won't do much to it, but it'll do enough damage to the rest of the Ripper compound to take out most of his men. Uh, and if Jesse survives, you won't see us coming. You got it. Not a bad plan. Not the worst. Oh, gosh. Not the worst no, plan ever, but. We figure out how to get into the Iron Butte Valley without being seen, yeah? I'll get us there. You just hang on. You just hang on. Oh, I'm excited. I'm excited. Oh, shoot. Okay, sir. I'm going to need you to calm down. I got a sniper I haven't used yet. Boozer, what the hell is this? Okay, let's go. Come on. Come on, booze man. I don't know what the deal is with these guys, but they've set up shop over here. Ripper oh. Patrol. <laughs> I see him. Come on, rippers. Ooh, we're getting feisty. This is for you. No, you don't. Hello, hello, darkness, my old friend. Oh, oh my, booze man, boo. Dude, he runs in solo dolo. Now I have you. Yeah. Boost man's just swinging on nothing at the moment. I got you, Boost man. More rippers. Damn it, I got him. Oh, it's a one shot to the chest, even. Booze man is just like moral support at this point, I think. Pop up. Oh my. You okay? <laughs> I've been better. Come on. Right. I've been better. Behind you. All right. Is there any loot here? Y'all got some fat loot for me? Because I'm going to need one of those bandages. 
There we go. Let's pop a bandage. And uh, let's see if we can loot from these guys. I'm a big fan of looting stuff, if you guys haven't noticed. I'm a big fan of looting stuff. They really converted this cave, huh? Ooh. Are oh, there some more ammo and stuff? I was thinking that there's probably like a med kit or something. Really, med kits are... They're really good. That's what they are. They're really, really good. Get these two. And back on the bike. Let's be real. My shot is incredible at the moment. I took a couple days off of Days Gone. But my shot's still... Prim and proper, man. Still filthy with it. I'll say my driving abilities seem to have taken a an increase as well in skill. Oh, 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 oh! That's... Head south from here. Following you. <laughs> oh, oh! This isn't creepy. Ow. All right. Oh, they got a lot of fires and. Okay, we're definitely in Ripper territory. Oh, this is normal. This is normal. I remember this. Hit them with the ya yeet. All right, 400 meters away. It's a beautiful day here in Ripper country. Very beautiful day in Ripper country. We're gonna give them a piece of our mind today. We're gonna make sure that the Rippers are no more. That's what we're gonna do. Screw Carlos and his whole gang of freaks. Okay? They call the zombies freakers. These guys are the real freakers. Shane Aviles, thanks for becoming a member and welcome to Elite. Enjoy those emotes as well as typical James. If you want to join as well, link in the description below. Let's get this done. They ain't going to make this easy. Nope. Ooh. What are you doing? Figured I'd take this bag of explosives down there and ask him if they didn't mind us, you know, blowing him the fuck out. <laughs> Look, you stay up here with Skizzo's rifle and keep him off me while I set the charges. Oh, hold, hold on. Look, I got this. Not much good in a firefight, but I can plant these charges. I've set demo charges before, Boozer, in Afghanistan. I know exactly where to put them. Good. Tell me where to go when I'm down there. We're doing this? Yeah. All right. I love him as a team, man. Nothing better happen to either of them in this whole story. If anything happens to them, I'm gonna gonna be mad. I don't think this is okay, the final mission. I'm gonna be up in this tower. Should give me a good view of the entire dam. I'll wait here until you get up there. Imagine it is. Be a short game. Not really that short. Yeah, stay low, move fast. You got it, brother. Who's it? Oh, never mind. Go, go. All right, well. Where, where do I set the first charge? You see the second set of scaffolding on top of the dam? Okay, heading there now. Oh, you got this, Boozer. Got it. Finally. All right, Jeez. set the first charge. Ooh, look at that. All oh, right there, that's good. The hell is that noise? Is that a falcon? Done. All right, moving on to the next one. Nice job, Bruce, man. Keep going. Take. No, it's okay. How did I miss that? I almost let Boozer down. Are you gonna keep him off me? Am I gonna keep him off you? There you go. Set it. You're good. That wasn't so hard. Rod, booze man. You got this. I got him. Oh, shoot. 
Watch you hit a ramp. Keep it up. Just move your ass. <laughs> I only got so many more shots. Is there ammo up here? You got him? Oh. Oh god. Okay, how am I supposed to take this guy out? I'm so sorry, bro, but that guy took a lot more shots than, than I thought he would have. This guy's like, what's happening? Where do I set the next charge? Ricky Honestly? Got the pen stock, the big pipe, the base of the dam. Position. Mm -hmm. Okay. Ooh, look at that dam. I can't wait to see it explode. All right. Third charge. In position. Just move your ass. Okay, you try doing this with one hand and a blade. <laughs> Honestly, fair hand. enough. Sometimes I wish I had a blade hand. A blade hand would it's be done. cool. Shoot! Oh, he hit me hard! Bite me, dude. I lost, like, all my health. That one guy just leveled me. Oh, shoot. You gotta get him off me! You ain't gotta tell me twice. I gotta craft some more of these. We're good. All right. Fourth charge. I'm gonna hide here now. I'm, I'm gonna not stand up. That's the last of them. Get off him. Bro, I shot him twice. I'm going as fast as I can. Damn, that guy ate a sniper shot. He wasn't caring. I third partied him. <laughs> Get bodied, honestly, though. You got bodied. Jeez. Holy shit. Are you okay? Uh, yeah. Body. Yeah, I think so. Unless, wait a minute, was this already? <laughs> well, that never gets old, does it? Uh. Let's, uh, let's go find Jesse. He's like, uh, there's a lot more water than I thought there would be. <laughs> Just a little bit of water. When the sink logs. Alright, so I should have taken out a lot of them. Brother, you, uh, you did a hell of a job back there. Yeah? I thought I was done for a couple of times. Yeah, I'm sorry about that. What the hell are you talking about? This is the most alive I've felt since... Ah, uh, shit. You remember when we got trapped by that horde in Tumalo? We ain't done yet. All right. How many do you think we killed? I don't know. They had it coming, right? Yeah, they <laughs> had it coming. Yes, we all did. They had it coming, right? 
Yikes. Okay, a decent amount have to had to have got taken out from that, right? I'm not saying every single ripper had to be taken out, but there had to be a decent amount gone there. At least one guy got bodied by a tree, so. All right, looks like we go in on foot from here. You want to stay? Keep any stray rippers from ripping off my bike? Yeah, I don't think we need to worry about that. <laughs> and fuck that. This? This is on Jesse. You wanted some payback? I'll show him some fucking payback. Ooh. This is the mission I've been waiting for, man. Come on, let's head to the lodge. Like I said, right behind you. I'm gonna take out my AR. This must be what it looked like after Noah's flood. Came and washed away all the wicked. Yeah, except God had nothing to do with this one. Yeah. You get my point. Oh, shit. More rippers. How the hell did they survive? Oh, they didn't. They just don't know it yet. Jake! <laughs> Our left! Our left! Yeah, yeah, I got this. Oh. Yeah, yeah, that's right. Come on, you want some? Can you die? Oh, shoot, man's on fire. Ah, go down. Get low. Oh, shoot. Ooh, that's two sniper shots to take out that guy. That ain't bad. Hey! Over here, you son of a bitch! <laughs> that a guy? I shot him in the kneecap. Oh, Boozer's already dead. Boozer, what are you doing? Oh, they're flooding through this gate over here. Down. Oh, come on, you bitches. Uh, come is that that's a big one over there? Oh, I can't hit him with a shot. Oh yeah, that's a breaker. Uh, did they harness the power of a breaker? Shot the guy in the back. Oh gosh. Chat, uh, he won't die. Uh, you give me a second there, huh, booze man? Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot, this isn't fair. No, I don't like this. Body. Oh god. Oh shoot. Oh. <laughs> oh, he's chasing me now. This is a good. Okay. No, it's a little unfair when you do that. I tell you that. Are you bro could just stab him in the back a little bit, huh? That would have been nice. It's okay, I don't blame you. He was a, he was a big guy. He's a real big guy. Alright. 
Let's uh let's continue on over here, huh? That's literally zombie hulk, I agree. Literally zombie hulk. Okay. Just need to get a bit of uh Oh no, I didn't mean to do that. More bounties. Thank you. All right, let's get in here. Zombie juggernaut. No, you don't. Don't. You are now free. Oh, that hurt. I don't feel very free. Covering fire. Dude. Boozer's just going in there, huh? Okay, that's it. You are lost. They are free. Free. I I think that's a better way of doing it for me at least. Who's man? Stab him. <laughs> Again. Come on. That's the last of them. Woo! You ready to find Jesse? Time to finish what we started. There's no way you're getting up there. <laughs> the the Damn it. Here. I'll boost you up. Okay. Listen. I can throw him down here. Something happens to me. There's a trail not far from here. You no, 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 no. Listen, that is not Carlos up there. Okay, not this founder. Rest in peace. It's fucking Jesse Williamson, fucking low life piece of shit scumbag who got what was coming to him. All right. Now you fucking go up there and kill that son of a bitch. What the heck? He sprayed some powder in my face. Time to get low, brother. Time to get low. Oh, you want to get low? Deacon Saint John brought low by the lowly Jesse Williamson. Oh, shoot. Rot low. Ah, do you remember, remember back, back in, in the day? day you and Boozer oh, held me down while Jack burned the flesh from my back. Oh. Carlos just got bodied. Oh, he's not dead yet. He's dead? I kind of like how realistic that fight was. Good being on this shit again, you know. <laughs> I gotta say, shoveling shit and you know, pulling weeds. I don't know, maybe it isn't such a bad way to spend the day. Yeah. <laughs> wow. Well, Jesse gone. How many you think are left? People that we knew from before, I mean. No one. Boosie, there's no one left. Shit. Sorry. Uh, yeah. Me too. Come on, let's get the yeah, fuck out of here. Well, I guess there doesn't need to be a treaty anymore. I 
I I think that like honestly, would Iron Mike be mad? Cause like they were causing problems and we kind of just took care of it. So although we didn't have we don't have dynamite to destroy the horde, you know, we took out the rippers, which have been an increasingly increasingly big problem. So I think there's that. Justin Bayer, thanks for becoming a member and welcome to Lee. Enjoy those emotes if you want to join as well. Link in the description below. I said, I, I know we haven't talked in a few years. I guess I disfigured with my Elizabeth being there with you and all. It probably wasn't much point in me yammering away at you. Oh, and then, and what with all hell breaking loose, I, I thought maybe you weren't there. Or you just didn't give a shit. Pardon my language. I guess that's why I'm here. Say, I still don't know. I hope you're there. Hope there's some reason for all this shit we're living through. That's all. We'll, we'll we'll talk again some other time. Oh, um, amen. <laughs> this might be the end of the game. Deke? Uh, <clears throat> yeah, Ricky told me that I could find you here. Oh! Uh, uh, it's just these knees of mine, you know. It's reason I haven't been praying all these years. Yeah, I'm not a, I'm not a church-going type. Even after living through that shit storm in Sherman's camp. But now, after all this, I just thought, hell, I, maybe it, now it's the time. I, uh, I didn't have a choice, Mike. Oh, everybody's got a choice, Deke. Until they're dead. either us or them <laughs> it's always us or them always you know the reason we're going to hell is we can't figure out that us is every goddamn soul that ain't walking around in shit stained pants trying to eat us all right you know what you may not like it but the world is what it is yeah it is praying ain't gonna <laughs> change that <laughs> wishing that. that it was yeah it else. is Ain't gonna make it that way, Mike. Wish it ain't got anything to do with it. We make the world what it is by what we do. All of us. I let him go. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Schizo. Ain't no way he's getting a fair trial. <laughs> you let him go. Told him to ride out, not come back. Jesus Christ, Mike, do you have any idea what the fuck you've done? Yeah. I stopped another killing. And you know what? I guess I'm good with that. He's going to come back. He's going to screw everybody up at the camp. He's going to start his own thing. That was risky, man. That was risky, Iron Mike. I like I I do like Iron Mike. I do. It's a lot of trust. I like how I gained trust from Iron Mike's camp, but like really did not in in actuality. All righty. Drive to the location. I was distracted. So... Oh, we have to go back to our bike. What's up with this? We never got this historical marker. 
feel like we should get it while we're here. I mean, I don't think Boozer and Deke are going to let it go, you know? Grown from outer space moon trees. Hmm. Actually quite interesting, quite. Whee! Oh, look at my office. Whee! Alright, that was a fun mission. The boss fight, I kind of liked it how he didn't take like 50 million stabs, no, right? This is your clutch. I know where the clutch is. Right, do you want me to show you how to do this or not? Yes, but I know what a clutch is. Okay, fine. All right, you do it yourself, okay? Fine. Flashback to his wife learning what a clutch is. Do you know what a clutch is, chat? This can't be the end of the story. I, seeing some people say that there's more, so. Okay, I'm happy. Because I didn't want it to end right here. I'm enjoying the game. We're starting to get some good weaponry. There has to be a lot more to it. But I feel like this is a, a significant part of the story has been dealt with today in this video. And with the taking down of Carlos. Freaking Carlos. The only thing more detrimental than rippers and freaks is probably the loading screens in Days Gone. <laughs> Where's the sniper? I don't think I actually got the sniper. Hey, hey, hey! What are you doing? You can't park here. Uh, I'm just here to pick it's up Sarah. Property. Now turn around. Get the hell out of here. Come on. Okay. <sighs> Move it. Yep. <sighs> Uh, okay, uh, you know what, though? I think I'm just gonna wait right here. You can go back to doing your guard the cornfields thing. This is Officer Moore at the gate. We got an issue here. Hey, listen, asshole. This is a restricted area. I told you, get the hell out of here. Hey, hey, you just wait right there. I told you. Move it. It's like I was trying to say. I'm just here you to pick up... Did you not see that sign? Oh, look at that. That's kind of hard to miss. I'm authorized to use <laughs> deadly force. Yeah, thank you. Thank you. Hey, hey, whoa, whoa, what's going on? <laughs> I'm sorry, Miss Whitaker. It's, it's what, fine, I, Do you know this asshole? Yeah, he's with me. He's with me. Sorry, ma'am. I, I on, didn't know go. that... It's fine. Honestly, I apologize. Shh. Oh, and Jim... Deacon. I'm not with her. She's with me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, and Jim... Why do you always do that? Do what? Act like such a dick. Oh, come on. He started it. What are you, five? Hey, watch the clutch. Remember, you gotta give it enough gas, rev up the RPMs. I got this. Yeah, I can hear. Where are we headed? Over to the dam. That's a nice, quiet road, right? Are you driving? No. Are we still going out tonight? You said something might come up. Uh, crap, yeah, uh, Boozer and the boys want to ride down to Klamath State, visit Jack. So you're gonna blow me off to go see some guy in prison? Jack's not some guy. I know, I know. I was kidding. Damn, this game looks beautiful. They should really wear helmets though, huh? I feel like that's important. Be a good idea to wear helmets. If you guys are gonna ride a motorcycle, wear a helmet, please. I'm pretty pleased. Pretty pretty pleased. I like I kinda like the flashbacks because it actually takes you like through the game engine, not just cutscenes. Oh shit, look out! Oh god. These oh, drivers, god. man. But every time I'm on a bike with you, some idiot in a truck tries to run us off the road. Oh, my God. No, no, no. no. Listen, listen, listen. You did great. You did great. Uh, most people, they would have panicked. They would have oversteered, and that would have gotten us killed. I almost did get us killed. I was... No, no. I wasn't paying attention, and I was distracted. Hey, it's okay. It's okay. Just breathe. You're okay. Wait a second. What did, what did you mean, distracted? 
Oh, no, it's just stuff going on at work. It's nothing. I just... Oh. Okay. Oh, I just thought maybe you uh, saw my new patch. Your what? No. No, Matt? Wait, you, you quit the club? No, I didn't quit the club. I would never quit the club. Uh, uh, nomad, what it means is, um, well, I'll be less involved from now on. Deke, I didn't ask you to do that. Oh, I know, I know. And if you had, I would have said no. <laughs> you ready to try this again? Yeah, I mean, no, but He quit yeah, the club for her. He took a less of a role in the club for her. <laughs> Thank you for saving my life. <laughs> well, you know, I do what I can. Hey, hey, the clutch, the clutch. I know what the clutch is. Okay, no, no, the... Deacon. So, uh, you think your parents are gonna come? To the wedding? I don't know. I mean, you know, I, I thought if I stepped back from the MC that, uh... I don't think it's gonna matter to them, Deacon. But you're gonna, you're gonna at least tell them. Yeah, if you want me to. Look, it's just... I'm not gonna change who I am and who you are to make my uptight, middle-class parents happy. Okay. Look out. I see them. Hey, oh. are, they, are they headed to your work? Oh, shit. It's the sound of the police. What about the MC? Are any of them coming now that you've gone nomad? Oh. Uh, I don't know. Uh... Probably been a while since any of them set foot in a chapel, uh, and you really want 27 Harleys rolling up in that little church in Marion Forks? Yeah. You know what? As a matter of fact, I do. <laughs> uh, okay. All right, so there's a cop car over here. Cloverdale Research. Bro, these people started the zombie apocalypse, no doubt. Come on. A big old research facility in the middle of the country. We got sprinklers and stuff. Whitaker's return. What's going on? I don't know. Miss Whitaker. Yeah. Chief's been trying to get a hold of you. Says it's urgent. It's always urgent. Let him know I'll be right there. Okay. I gotta go. Hey, hey. <sighs> Sorry. It's fine. It's probably just a fire alarm or something small. Okay. Knock him dead. <clears throat> Love you. Um, just call me later. Or a zombie outbreak. <laughs> I love Deke. Deke's funny, man. I like the character they've built for Deke. I, th I think he's a... Like a sarcastic, kind of funny, but hard character. Basically the Humane Labs from GTA V. For real, right? That's what I'm saying. Sam Whitwer is Deacon's voice actor. Ooh, cool. Cool to know. Just join the stream. Welcome. Welcome. Hope every everyone that's tuned in is watching and enjoying. If you are, do me a favor, hit that like button. We're going to try to get 10,000 likes on this video. Make sure you subscribe if you are new. I'm going to read all super chats towards the end of the stream. So thank you, everybody, who has done those. Addy, I'm sorry. Whatever. Addy, whatever, Ricky. I'm sorry. God damn. Is it too late now to be sorry? Uh, O'Brien, this is St. John. Come back. O'Brien, this is St. Just answer your goddamn radio. St. John, didn't think I'd hear from you again. Yeah, neither did I. All right, listen, that night you bugged out. You told me that you didn't take any civilians. You just took uh, Nero personnel, feds, people with clearance. I told Shut up, shut up, shut up. Listen to me. Sarah, my wife, she had clearance. She had her ID badge with her the night that I put her on your chopper. I so don't think that just do me a favor, look it up. Sarah Irene Whitaker. She worked at Cloverdale. She had federal clearance. She was doing, uh, I don't know, research pharmaceutical. I don't know what she, the hell she was okay, doing. Just okay. do me. I'll see what I can find. Okay, great. O'Brien, remember, you owe me. Yeah, yeah. O'Brien out. Do owe me, O'Brien. I did so many sneaky missions for you. So many sneaky missions. It's Raccoon City all over again, right? I was distracted. Dealing with my past. Do you think freaks from 
remember anything? Do you remember? No. The 21st night <laughs> of September. Hey, I heard. You know? I mean, what you did for us. How you... The Rippers. All of them. I just... I know you had to do it. What else was going to stop them, you know? Yeah, I agree. Look, Blair, I'm not proud of what I had to do. You know that, right? I mean, it had... We had to... <laughs> look... They were coming. Yeah, yeah, I know. You don't have to explain anything to me. I was here when they attacked, remember? Oh, I remember. I, I don't know. Do you remember? I guess I'm just tired, you know? Yeah, I know. Can I not buy ammo for it? Bro, I can't buy ammo uh, for the crossbow. Yep. I'm going to have to find Deke, another one. Take care now. Deke, take care now. Okay, I'm going to go. Oh, what is this? Oh, that's a bounty hunter mission. Oh, there's neuro research points. Two, two of them I haven't gotten yet. Three of them I haven't gotten yet. Uh, so I gotta wait for a mission. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna jump into my office here, and I'm gonna run to the bathroom real quick. And you guys, let me know if a mission pops up. All right, be right back. St. John, this is O'Brien. O'Brien, what do you got? I need to see you in person. Jesus, O'Brien, just would you tell me what you found is is she, is she alive or isn't she? I have something to give you. O'Brien. I've transmitted the coordinates. Meet me there. O'Brien out. O'Brien. God damn it. Deep. Iron Mike's looking for you. He said. Booze man, listen. Just uh tell him I'll be back. I gotta. You remember what I told you, um, the night that Sarah died, Nero, they bugged out. They only took their own people, feds and people who had federal clearance levels. Wait, Deke, what the hell are you talking about? Look, it's probably nothing, but there's something I gotta do. Deacon out. Okay, okay, now beer back. Tell me your favorite part of Days Gone while I'm gone. Beer back. I heard somebody say every single minute of it is my favorite. The part the gun went boom and boom. Very descriptive. All right, so we got to head over to O'Brien's camp here. Why don't we... Okay, let's go to Copeland's camp. Let's return and get that mission done. And then we'll go ahead and head over to this other part. Uh, Texas Beast 306 thanks for becoming a member and welcome to Elite. Enjoy those emotes if you want to join as well. Link in the description below. We got quite a few members today. We got seven new members, I think, today. Shout out to all y'all for the incredible support. Really do appreciate it. Do you remember the 21st night of September? Is there a way? Oh, there is a way to do giveaways here. Oh, that's cool. Okay. Uh, let's head in here. Come on, you bitch. Oh, hey, open up. Yeah, yeah, booze man, what's up? I just, I just wanted to say thanks for the dog. What's up? It's no worries, brother. I mean, it, it followed me. You know, wouldn't leave me alone. What was I supposed to do? Hey, hey, get down. Hey. <laughs> yeah, sure, it followed you. Hey, uh. 
Jack. Jack, I like it. Jack the dog. <laughs> yeah, Jack would have loved that. Uh, no, he wouldn't have, which is why I did it. <laughs> <laughs> Get bodied. All right, easy, easy, buddy. All right, all right, enough, enough. Okay, Deke, I gotta go. Boozer out. Boozer out. You're welcome. Information. St. John, I got a bounty job for you. I'm listening. You're looking for Ned Walker. Wears a red scarf. He and his crew came to the gate the other night. We wouldn't let him in. He killed one of my guards and took off. Well, that's not very nice at all. Follow him. He's holed up at a marauder camp just north of O'Leary Mountain. I think you know where that is. No, but I'll find him. Thanks, bro. I thought I was coming back to get my mission done. Apparently not, though. Let's refuel this thing. You don't want to run out of fuel in the shit. That's for sure. No, you do not want to run out of the fuel. All right, so we got to go to O'Brien here. Why am I here? Oh, cool. See, I'm glad I already did like half these Marauder camps. I'm drifting. His name's Deacon St. John. That's a pretty cool name. Right? How did the writers even come up with people's names? Like Deacon St. John. You gotta say it with a bit of an accent. Deacon St. John. Oh, shoot. Oh, oh my goodness gracious. My bike just went 4x4. Four four. That's what just happened. Let's hit that NOS, hit that turbo. This is Radio Free Oregon. The truth shall set you free. Well, oh. Let me tell you. <laughs> I've only died like three times in this game. That's one of them. Can you believe that? I've only died like three times in this game, and that was one of them right there that you just saw. What is this? There's a C? Oh, Copeland. Oh, I did return to him for something. Oh, you know what? It was kind of worth it. How have you been? Hey, Damon. How's the gun trade oh. going? Never mind. All right. Let's head back in. What information, O'Brien? What the hell can you possibly have left to say? Hey, All right, let's head through. Uh, hold on, I'll get Thank you for getting the gate. I'm much appreciated. Oh my! Oh, bro, <laughs> can't make this stuff up. Oh boy. Okay. My driving abilities. I was talking about how good my driving abilities were earlier. I think the game is punishing me for that. Just a little bit. Oh my goodness. That noise, bro. You good? Yeah. You good? What do you want? Yeah. Said what that? you want, huh? What is this right here? Some bottles. Bottles on bottles. Oh, there's more of them. Get the heck out of the way. I mean business. Like, I'm just trying to meet with O'Brien, okay? You better have some good news for me. Oh, he's here. Oh, okay. Wait, do I have to mess with those guys? Oh, hello. Wait, what? So what the hell? I managed to recruit a few guys who I trust who, like me, aren't happy with what's going on. So why am I here? I wanted to give you this. You were right about your wife. 
Where did you get this? When Silver Lake evacuated, they took Nero personnel, federal officials, and well, Sarah Irene Whitaker had a class four federal clearance level. Clearance level. The wife bugged out with a recon unit, east of Fort Rock. Take me there. No. <laughs> Take me no. there. Well, you got a ride. We're all friends now. The base is gone. What? A year ago. Local militia group. Militia group? Where's their camp? We don't know. How the hell can you not know? You got a helicopter. You got satellites. Somewhere around Crater Lake, but it's a no-fly zone, okay? They got outposts, rockets, RPGs. Crater Lake. Crater Lake. Oh, I wanted to tell you about the work we're doing. Studying the infected, the freaks. They're evolving. As bad as things are right now, they're gonna get worse. They're evolving? I don't like that. No, I don't like that. Well, we got a little bit of hope now that our wife's alive. Drive to location, riding nomad again. I go to hell, bright. I don't give a shit about any of that. Boozer, booze man, come back. Yeah, Dean. Hey, listen, listen to me. Uh, a year ago, we were with Iron Mike. We were thinking about riding south. But the Santium Pass was blocked. There was no way through, and he said that he knew another way. Yeah. Iron Mike is, is not too happy with us right now. Just listen to me. Just listen. Do you remember what he said? Iron Mike? Yeah, he was, he was bragging about knowing every road trail in 100 miles. He was he the trail of the Brown Mountain Fields. Tielson, Tielson, yeah, that's it. Tielson, I guess. Yeah, why the hell are you? Shit. We've talked to. She's alive. Sarah's alive. Hey, listen to me, O'Brien. They, uh. Loser, he found her ID badge. Loser, uh. I, I think that she's alive. Ain't that the truth? I don't know, Boozer. I don't know, uh, but God, if there's even a chance that she's alive, I I gotta find her. God damn right. Uh, shit, I, I gotta go. Uh, Ricky and Annie need need help on the shelf or some goddamn thing. Look, I'll, I'll see you when you get back to camp. The weather's so bad. Okay, okay, see you. Holy smokes, the weather is so bad. Can't even see where I'm going. It's so rainy and stormy. He like low key just talked to himself, but that's okay. We accept him, right, chat? We accept him. No problem. Let's see what the old man's got to say. The graphics are beautiful, though. Look at this. That's nuts. I get a lot of Uncharted vibes from this game. What? Advancing the story will lock you out from northern regions. Uh, what? Uh, okay. Did we do it? Did we do it yet? I said we do it. I said we do it. I'm sure we'll get to come back at some point, right? Ah, let's go. Proceed. Proceed. Michael Konatzer, thanks for becoming a member, dude, and welcome to Lead. Enjoy those emotes. You get exclusive emotes if you didn't know. If you want to join as well, link in the description below. Let's see what's up. Do it for Sarah. I do it for Sarah. 
Why my cup look yellow? It is white. I must change my coloring. All right, let's see what happens. So there's like a north and south. You know, way over the Tielson Pass. He told me once that I I'd... told you nothing. Go on. Oh, I can't on. help you, Deke. Just draw me a goddamn map. After everything you've done. After everything I've. What about what you've done, old man? Huh? <laughs> Sherman's you camp. On. The things that you, you get did. Out of here. You listen, me, listen, me. listen to me. What if? You could take it all back, huh? What if you could fix it? I thought I put Sarah on a chopper. I felt relieved. How fucked up is that? Uh, I was relieved, Mike. That's what I've been living with. And now you're chasing ghosts. You think finding your old lady, if she's alive, you think that's gonna fix it? Make you whole? I don't know, but I gotta try. Let me try, Iron Mike. Let me try. All right. If I do this, what you want, show you the way over the pass. You don't come back. All right? You promised me you don't come back. I got you. I've done so much for the camp, Iron Mike. He's just like, he's so like neutral. It hurts. He's so, like, he's a nice guy. It's just he's so neutral. Shit. Now I gotta talk to Boozer. After riding south with Iron Mike, you won't be able to return to Lost Lake for a while. Make all purchases and upgrades while you still can. Okay. Well. I don't think I need to buy anything. But, like, I'm gonna go check out if I can. I'll buy a motorcycle upgrade or so. Whee! Whee! Let's see what we can do. Uh, any motorcycle upgrades we should do? Hey, Deacon. Buzz, how's a camper's life? I think we got everything here. Yeah, everything's upgraded. Uh. There. Good as new. Refuel. Blah blah. Let's see weapons. So, if I could buy a special weapon, I might, but I don't think this camp sells special weapons, so... Let's see. Deacon, good to see you. Uh, I could buy a little stubby shotgun. A.K.A. the little stubby. Or I could buy a crowdbreaker shotgun. M50 at Rising. You know what? Let's just leave it how it is. Actually, should we buy a CA rifle? Should we do it? Should we do it? Oh, that's a lot of money, though. It's a lot of money to buy. Ah, I kind of want to do it. Let's do it. No, I'm not vouching for that. That's expensive. Oh, you can buy it if you get more trust. All right, let me put this. Ooh, we got a new sniper. Yep. Look at this thing on my back. <laughs> All right, Deep. let's go. Take care now. I swear this big red truck wasn't here before. And hey, where's the dog at? Moving on. Meeting with Boozer will advance the story, locking you out of Lost Lake as you ride south with Iron Mike. Make sure you take the time to turn in any last bounties or visit any vendors before you talk to Boozer. Turn in any bounties. I don't have any bounties left. I I think literally all the bounties went away, so. Alright. Last leg, it's been real. Alright. Let's talk, booze man. Oh, we took off our vest. Holy shit. Uh-huh. Right. I... Last winter, we were up on Farewell Ridge. We were watching the freaks. Thousands, thousands of them. I mean, too many to count. Yeah, I remember. All I could think was every one of us, man, woman, and child, are now homeless. A bunch of goddamn refugees. Yeah. What belongs to them now? We'll survive. Yeah, we've been doing that all right. Surviving. Isn't living. 
Ooh. Something Jack used to say. Doesn't matter when you hit the road where you're heading out to, but you damn well better know where you're coming home to. That's deep. That's yeah, deep. We never talked about it. While we still wore the colors all this time out in the freak show and shit like this didn't matter anymore. Yeah, yeah but I think. Last two Mongols on Earth, farewell originals. Uh, the biker boys, most badass drifters on the broken road. Damn straight. Yeah, I guess we did become sort of a brand. Yeah. We were a lot of things, but we were never a brand. <laughs> <laughs> they could have had their own Twitter and YouTube channel, see? And we wrote out a farewell. Without Sarah, without Jack, or anyone. I knew that we were... Leaving everything behind. Everything that mattered was gone. Said this. You're a nomad again, huh? Yep, I guess I am. Oh, look at the dog. Come on, Jack. Inside, let's go. If she's out there, you can find her. If you tattoo your head, do you grow hair? Deke, you ready? Yeah, Mike, I'm ready. Meet me at the gate. Don't keep me waiting. Yeah, sure, Mike. Whatever you say. For real, I never thought of that. If you tattoo your head, do you grow hair? Me, yeah, like stunts your hair growth or something. Never thought of that. Hey. Hey, Big Mike is taking you over the pass. Yep. You really think she's still alive? Billions of people are dead, but somehow she made it. Hey, we made it, didn't we? If I give up now, if I don't, if I don't do this, well, then I'm just gonna end up like, uh... Like us, right? Like Iron Mike, like Boozer? What'd you call us? Campers, yeah? Chill. You go, and you find your woman. I love her. Addie's the best. You know where to find me. <sighs> she got bodied. Hey, you know what? You know what I think, Deacon? I think that you're you're afraid to be here. You're afraid to be a part of something. We need you here, and that scares the hell out of you. I'm sorry. <sighs> yeah, me too. I love how my axe on my back is just all bloody, just completely covered in blood. You ready? Yeah, I want to get the hell out of here. Uh, excuse me, Mike. Why are we riding at night? Just throwing it out there. Don't think it's a good idea. I don't like it very much. Come on. This way. Okay, I'm following you. Let's go, Mike. Iron Mike. All Mikes are Michaels, right? Nobody actually born with the name just Mike. <laughs> I'm realizing so many things today, guys. That I probably already knew. I'm just vocalizing, you know? Alright, so we're gonna head south. Shit. 
I got one. Didn't know what the hell to do with it. <laughs> that sounds like Jack. Oh, you ran a pretty tight club. Or you boys raised some hell back in the day. But I don't think you murdered anyone. Not in cold blood. Damn. It's not murder if they shoot at you first. Damn. What's up, Deacon? Are you kid friendly? I try not to swear, but the game swears quite a bit, so. A few. Thousands. Too many to count. Highway be bumper to bumper with SUVs and campers chock full of sunburned moms, beer chugging dads, and their snot nosed kids. Goddamn rainbow, floppy hats, Hawaiian shirts, and flippy flops. All flippy flops. They come. A trail of colorful ants from LA to farewell to here, nonstop. I'm glad I avoided road trips out here that time of year. We gotta ride right through the barrier. Oh, I didn't do this, Mike. It wasn't me. Oh, oh God, he kind of just ran over him. Oh, uh, okay. Alrighty. Oh, yep, you go first, sir. Thank you. Oh, yeah, excuse me. There you go. Yep, They're, they were weird, man. That's why I took them out, Mike. Don't even worry about it. I'm just gonna go ahead. You're going a bit slow. Hope you don't mind. Alright. There you go, Mike. Mike's very careful with it, huh? We can use the help. We can use the help. I don't have a choice, Mike. Fair enough. Come on, just follow me. Mike's like bipolar though. <sighs> yeah, okay. Like I'll come back sometime. I don't want to dedicate myself here. Oh, this is the uh facility she worked at. Overdale. Oh, it's snowing up here. Okay. Oh, this is not a very friendly. It's not a very welcoming bridge. I must say. A whole new. Oh. Goodness gracious, that's not healthy. Oh, it's really snowy now. I don't think bikes are meant to be on snow. This is an assumption. Oh, we're getting snow we This is it. This is as far as I go. Keep following the trail. It'll take you down the mountain, on into the Diamond Lake Valley. I wish you luck. Hope you're right about your old lady still being alive. She is. Well, maybe so. But you gotta ask yourself, Deke. What does it matter if everyone else is dead? I think it matters quite a bit, man. My dude misses his wife. Alright. Let's ride in here. Can we see where we are on the map? Oh, look at this. It's like frozen on the map here. Alright, let's ride in. Riding Nomad again. We, ra we rode Nomad once for Sarah. And we're doing it again. Screw this. We don't take the, the path. We ain't like that. We make shortcuts. I mean, zombies wouldn't be around here, right? I feel like snow doesn't mix well with them. Sorry, freakers. If you will. Oh, look at our legs. They're like, pure frosty white. There's gonna be like a horde.
you're out there, I'll find you. That's not good. What's happening over here? Oh, shoot! Bro! Kill the rager? The zombie- Come on, come on, come on! I don't like this! I don't like this. Can't you? Oh! Jesus, I don't know what we would have done without oh, you, man. Oh, come on. Hey, Thank okay, you, all right, man. all right, all right. It's dead. It's cool. Man of the hour. Oh, God. I'm Russell. Glenn Russell. This is Private Mullins. Uh, Rick. Hey, Rick. Uh, I'm Deacon St. John. Did, did you say private? Yeah. Yes, sir. The Shoots County Militia. You're not from around here. You come over the pass? Uh, no, no, no. I've just been uh, drifting. I came over the uh, salt flats east of Silver Lake. <laughs> What? what the hell are you doing out here, man? How'd you get across the 97? Whoa, 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 whoa. Jesus, man. What? This guy just saved your freaking life. The colonel told us to look out for anybody entering the territory, north or south. It, it, well, it, it, freaking slow your roll, man. We'll let the captain deal with that, okay? Fine. He just killed a freaking ranger, dude. <laughs> Come with us. We got a camp just by Diamond Lake. Get you three hots in a cot. Least we can do. Okay, yeah, sounds good. What about Flores? We can't just leave him. Uh, oh. You stay here. I'll come back with some fuel. No. Listen, stay here. Use his ammo if you gotta. You'll be fine. Okay? All righty then. This is a whole new dynamic. Following you. Our bike looks so damn cool. Can I skin the bear quick? You gotta stick with me, okay? Been having some trouble with squatters out here oh. the past few weeks. Patrol picks you up, could be trouble. Okay, got it. So, uh, the shoots county militia? Look, man, all I know is they feed me. They want me to salute and yes, sir. I salute and say yes, sir. How big's your outfit? Camp out here, we got a hundred, maybe more. Hard to keep track. Back at HQ, a whole lot more than that. HQ? Yeah, okay. okay. Uh, any women? Hell, that what you're about? Well, you can forget it. Girls got rules about that. Frat, fratern, fratern, fraternizing. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that. Look, you pull your weight, follow orders, nobody messes with you. Women, same as the men. Don't matter to the colonel. I'm not. Uh... Listen, I, I'm just, I'm looking for some people and a woman that I rode with a year back or so. They would have come over from Silver Lake. They would have been at one of those Nero refugee camps, I think. Silver Lake? Jesus, man. Silver Lake's been gone a lot longer than that. Yeah, yeah. It's too goddamn easy to lose track of time out of here, you know? Anyway, you guys, uh, do you pick anyone up? Survivors, I mean, from, uh, from the refugee camp. Maybe. Like I said, it's a big freaking army, you know? Ask the captain. He came in across the salt flats, I think. He might know. Captain? Yeah, Corey. He commands the Diamond Lake outpost. We're Corey. There. Oh, look at this base. Holy smoke. It's Russell. Open up. Look at this base. <laughs> this is a zombie apocalypse base. 
the other camps we stand at, they're they're nothing compared to this. Let's be real. Hey Jassy the Gamer, thanks for becoming a member and welcome to Leet. Enjoy those emotes if you want to join as well. Link in the description below. Report. Captain, sir, we had him. We did. Found his bike still smoking. I bet you lost him, huh? No, sir. I mean, yeah, we lost him. We ran into a rager, sir. Where's Mullins? Flores? Flores is dead, sir. I'll have Mullins with the body. That'll be all, Corporal. Go get some fuel. Head back to Mullins. You know what to do. Yeah. Yes, sir. If it wasn't for this man, we'd all be dead, sir. I sort of promised him some food and a safe place to camp tonight, sir. Corporal, get the fuck out of here. I see he got bodied. And you are? Name's Deacon St. John. Name's Corey. Derek Corey. <gasps> are you okay? Yeah, I'm sorry. Um, I'm sorry, I'm a little tired. I've been on the road for a long time. Your man Russell said you were recruiting. <sighs> well, are you interested? I've been looking to settle down. Yeah, find a camp. I'm interested. Come on. Chat. He's wearing the ring we gave her wife. So. How long Let's you been work, drifting? People, Hard moving. to say. Uh, yeah, you lose track of time, yeah, yeah, yeah. you know. So, uh, where'd you get your gear? Ammo. Well, there was a couple of camps I used to do runs for. Bounty hunting, mostly. Freaks? Or men? Both. I had a reputation for being able to track shit down, you know? Well, which camps? Where are they? You know, past the Farewell Valley. It doesn't matter. They're gone now. They're overrun. Uh... Russell said you were there when Silver Lake was overrun. <laughs> yeah. That was a shit show, I can tell you. Uh, any survivors? A few. Why are you not working hard? Why are you... Why are you not working hard? Look, it's the ring in the loading... Look at the bottom right. Oh, okay. Well. Take this. Militia script. Camp credits. Payment for helping my men. Use them at any of the commissaries. Okay. You gonna join up? Stick around. We're getting ready to ride out of here soon. Getting ready to ride out where? You said you had some tracking skills. Yeah, some. This isn't the life of a drifter. We're fighting a war out here. You sure you're up for it? Is that the best you got? <laughs> I can recruit you. But the colonel is the only one who can swear you in. You stick around. Give us a hand. I'll take you to him myself. I'll be here. Good. I'd be like, what's the story with the ring, bro? Jesus, Jesus motherfucker has my ring. He took it from Sarah. He had to take it from Sarah because she wouldn't have given it to him. So that means that she's got to be here. Ooh. Okay. This camp's legit, though, huh? He doesn't look like militia. You can run fast. Hey, uh, you don't look very militia to me. No, um, man, name's Wade. Wade Taylor. You can call me Wade. Deacon St. John. <laughs> Holy Listen. shit. Deacon St. John? Is your old man a preacher or something? No. Man, that is a hell of a name. All right, listen. <laughs> you see this, man? This is some crazy shit. Yeah. Whew. So what, you joining up, becoming an army man, you playing soldier and shit? I don't know, maybe. Listen, uh, you look like you just came in from out the shit, right? Yeah, man, yesterday, okay, yesterday. I've been, I've been waiting to see the colonel, whatever the hell that is. Traveling with some people, we got separated. You see anyone that looked like this around here? Uh, nah, man. Ooh, but she is a looker. I'd hit that, you know. <laughs> uh, I gotta go, man. They're checking me for lice or some shit. Good luck to you, Deacon St. John. Jesus, what a name. Jesus, that dude's fucked up. He wouldn't remember Sarah if she slapped him in the face. Come on, Sarah. Come on. Where the hell are you? So search the Diamond Lake Militia Encampment. Somewhere. 
Maybe in these tents. Hello, Sarah. No, she wouldn't be in the mechanics area. She never knew a wrench from a screwdriver. Let's check this one. No. Sarah. Oh, is that you, Sarah? The infirmary. I mean, with her background, that's where she would be, right? Nope. Oh, damn it. She's not here either. Sarah? Gotta be the one. I don't Sarah. think she's here, bro. Sarah, you in here? There's a note. Shit. To protect Man. and serve. Cute drawings. Oh, God. I'm glad Sarah and I never had kids. Losing them must have been... That would be oh, God, super up. Not here. He's not here, but right, yeah, yeah, it couldn't be that easy. Go, could it? go, go! You gotta move you your ass. Say, you John, you on this channel? Come on, Corporal Russell said you had a radio. Ooh. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I'm here. Meet me at the gate. Meet you oh, at boy. the gate. All right. Nope. Hold up. Let me see. fill up my ammo. That'll last you. That all you need? Okay. Okay. How far are we on the map? Oh my gosh. How big is it? Oh my. This map's huge. What the heck is this thing? Okay. Let's go to the gate. I'm excited. You're getting ready to ride out. You still coming? Ready when you are. Looks like you put a lot of work into this. Yeah, some. I have the darn coolest bike, so I don't want to hear nothing. I wish I could change my outfit, though. That'd be cool, right? Are you any good? Can you ride? Uh, yeah. Yeah, I can ride. Do you want to join the militia? You're going to have to prove it to me. See if you can keep up, St. John. It's like a wasteland here. We haven't seen a freaker yet. So what the hell happened back so that's there? Good. I mean, it looks like a forest fire, but the stumps are charred. So that means that means that the timber was cut before it was burned. We got a good eye. We call it the dead zone. We use the timber to build our barricades and burn the slash. The outpost. We can see a horde coming long before it reaches us. What? We're gonna burn all the buildings too, so the newts and the swarmers have nowhere to sleep. So, like I said, I've been out in the ship for a long time. So that's your plan, huh? The militia, I mean, to burn everything to the ground? We're fighting a war out here, St. John. We'll do whatever it takes to win. A war? That's what it is, isn't it? A war? You've been out in the ship. You've seen the wards. The only thing that's gonna stop them is an army. Fair enough, honestly. It's gonna take way more than an army. That I rode with once, and I thought maybe they ended up there. Uh, I thought maybe you were after someone for a bounty. I mean. No bounty yeah, here. No, I tracked men over long distances before, but not this far. No bounty's worth that. This is it. Okay, they're both alive. That's good. Yeah, I killed a bear. It was no biggie. He was just a zombie bear. He's like, ah, and I was like, bah. that's pretty much it. That's the story, really. Hey, Corporal, the captain's here. It's done, sir. Make sure you make a marker. Yes, sir. All right. You two head back to Diamond Lake. Grab, uh, Taylor was his name? Yes, sir. Yeah. Take him to the Colonel. I'll be there in 1800. Sir? Military time, Corporal. You're supposed to know this by now. Oh, yes, sir. Get the fuck out of here. Yes, sir. <laughs> it's six o'clock, bro. Uh, how long is uh, Vasquez? Has Vasquez been with you guys? A couple of weeks, maybe more. <laughs> well, he's been busy. What the hell? You guys been having trouble with supply runs, marauder attacks? Yeah. Okay, we're gonna go on foot from here. On foot? Why? <laughs> because Vasquez came out here for a reason. I can't track him from the bike.
Where do we start? It's been snowing, so uh, there won't be any boot prints. <laughs> I Come mean, on. I want get to look inside the cabin. Over here okay, and I'm following you. Get the bear. Yeah. I got a rager ear. There we go. Alright. Oh. What's this? A squeaky toy. What is this? I got a dog toy. What is this? You uh <clears throat> you said you stole rations, ammo? Yes. This is an MRE. It's half eaten, so looks like your men rode up on him when he wasn't expecting it. His bike's still out front, which means that Ooh. he went out the back. Flammable. Wait, over here. What'd you find? The fence has been cut. And the rust. So it was cut recently. Yeah, come on, this way. Track the AWOL militia soldier. Hey, hold on for a second. Oh, there's some poop over here. Tracks? I know poop oh, yeah, when I see it. Luck. This way. Wait, 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 hold up. You find something? Yeah. Some shotgun shells. Shell casing. Recently fired. He uh well, he stopped to shoot at something. Come on, down here. Oh no. That's a wolf. Come on, get out of here. That ever work for you? Yelling at a wolf? Look out! More wolves! I see him! Oh no. Yeah, don't worry, bro. I got this. Yeah, I'm kind of a pro with it. Yeah, it looks like it. Nice work. Hey, I gotta skin these, bro. I don't know about you, but I gotta get some camp credits. Maybe even from your camp. I just need them. So, I hope you don't mind. I just take all this wolf meat. It's a kind of a commodity out here. I need to eat sometimes. And you guys haven't actually provided me with any meals to my knowledge, so. I'm just gonna go ahead and do my thing, alright? Oh, pardon me. Oh, pardon me. Oh, pardon me. I, I wanna take a look at this thing. Looks like all the right. MREs weren't enough for your man. Clean gunshot right through the head. Yeah, the wolves must have heard the shot. Decided they wanted it more than Vasquez. Yeah, the rest of the pack came at us from back that way, from the east. You think they chased off Vasquez, leaving one to guard the carcass? That's my guess. Come on, let's see if you're right. Okay. You guys got a lot of wolves out here. The ones that aren't infected, I mean. Yeah, we get reports almost every day. When I was Yikes. a kid growing up, there were no wolves in Oregon. I mean, a few coyotes, but... No wolves. They've been driven to extinction by ranchers and farmers, timber companies. Now they're uh, thriving. They're making a big comeback. Ain't that the truth? Take humans out of the ecosystem. See what happens to the ecosystem. Oh. Hold up, it's hold like... up, hold up. Hey, what is it? It's a backpack. Oh. It's one of ours. Looks like they almost got to him. And he shrugged off the pack to get away. No, no, no. To buy time. He landed on his ass. Tried to scramble away, but then the wolf lunged. Vasquez dropped him. Two shots. You can tell all that. Yeah. Where did Vasquez go? Wait, get down. A swarm. Oh. Near a grave site. Scattered all over the region. Now maybe that explains why uh, Vasquez came through here. Let's go around. That's a lot of zombies. Yeah, right there with you. I gotta say, you're getting tired of running and hiding from these sons of bitches. You ever take on a swarm? Yeah, I've done it before. This is gonna keep moving. Look, are you gonna join the militia? You must stay focused on the mission. We're not out here to fight freaks. Being in the shit, killing freaks, kind of goes hand in hand, doesn't it? Doesn't it? Okay. Um, put some distance between us and the graves. The cold weather's gonna Ooh. bring out even more of them. I think they can smell the corpse from about a mile out. Part of our slash and burn strategy is to find these grave sites, dig them up, and burn them along with everything else. Yeah, well, good luck with that. I've seen hundreds of them. It's just in this part of the state alone. We gotta start somewhere. 
Great. Right, where now? Keep heading east. Look at that swarm. Road ahead. Hold up a second. What do you think? Is anyone else tracking them? Not that I know of. Huh. Well, then he's either dead, or he's got a lot of friends. You see how his tracks have been overridden by bikes. A lot of bikes. Hmm. Okay. Come on. Let's see where they're heading. Hmm. You said cold weather brings out the freaks? Yeah, yeah. Cold, snow, rain, hell, even clouds. Well, like I said before, you know your freaks. When we get oh, I do. There's some people who want to talk to you. People? The colonel will fill you in if he lets you join. Yeah, yeah, I think you said that already. <laughs> Look, he runs a tight outfit. I just don't want you to get your hopes up. Hey, don't worry about me. I don't really... There's a train. Hear that? Yeah, it's coming from the logging camp over there. Is that on your map? Yeah. Well, that means it's also on Vasquez's map. Come on. If Vasquez is there, what would your strategy be? Well, he's not alone. We know that from the tracks. What's that militia penalty for going AWOL? Hanging by the neck until dead. Why? Well, it means Vasquez isn't coming without a fight. Oh, so this is a camp here. This is actually a pretty cool spot. I mean, the spot the militia has is kind of like all the way in, you know? This one's like, they just put up a couple fences. Nothing, nothing, nothing crazy, Samara. How you doing, Samara? She just dabbed. Samara, it's 2019. It's 2019, you can't dab. Okay, I gotta go back to this. Do you see your man? I'll go for a run with him. Yeah. That's him. Oh, looks like you guys need to start doing background checks on your recruits. He seems to be right at home. Well, let's wait here. I'll radio for backup. Get your goddamn hands off me! Oh, oh this one's a fighter, boys! On. What do you think? Oh, come on, Vasquez. Oh, see about that. Oh, hell no. What? Uh, I just got this problem with assholes who hurt unarmed women. I'm giving you an order. Order? You see me wearing a red arm back here? <laughs> Give me orders. Yeah, you do whatever the hell you want. Honestly, get bodied. Alright, mark a few. Okay, pardon me. Oh, shoot. Men coming! Oh, really? You gotta yell, men coming. Right, just keep your head down, bro. I just. Come on, I it's wise to keep your head down. Yeah, I told him. I, I think it's wise to keep his head down, but he don't care. I'm gonna move up. Oh, it's one shot too. It's good. Are you gonna pop out of cover? There you go. Oh shoot, there's a lot. St. John, I ow! That's it. All right, let's take care of this dirt bag. Oh, it's a Marauder camp. All right, I'll have to deal with him in a second. Oof! It's a little slidey slide. Oh shoot, sir! Hello. Got a lot of ammo left. Yeah, I don't got a whole lot of ammo. Left. Ain't that the truth? Oh, I have some. Uh, what is this? Time to burn! Don't shoot him! Let him burn! Oh, that's nice. What do you say now, huh? Little Molotovs and stuff. I mean. I'm doing just fine and dandy. Y'all seem to have some trouble controlling me here. I cannot get up there, can I? Yeah, I gotta go the other way. Oh, 
Oh, okay, you're the good guy still. I'm coming through. Oh, shoot. What's up? Sometimes you gotta spray and pray. Oh, he got bodied. He got bodied too. He got bodied three. That's the last of them. Yeah, I think so. Nice work. Coming in through the sides. Oh. You can handle them. I just killed 15 marauders. Of course, I can handle them. What? I came all this way. Which way am I supposed to go in? Get in. Are you got any ideas? Cause oh, can I just jump over to this? No, I can't. <laughs> I honestly don't know how to get in. Uh, I'm I'm open to ideas, Jet. At last. Oh oh my gosh! How didn't I see this? Yeah, this is it. I can get in through here. Easy, easy. I'm not gonna. I'm just here to help. I don't need your goddamn help. Okay. I'm just gonna move over here. <sighs> She's really s stabbing him in the business, huh? Away from me. Hold on, hold on. Now we're not with them. You think I give a damn who you are? Okay. Okay. Holy smokes. What the hell was that? Just uh, your typical damsel in distress. Vasquez? Done. Way done. Uh, yeah, he got uh, destroyed to say the least. Let me just go ahead and... I gotta just make everything I can. Craft, craft, craft. 18B, thanks for becoming a member. Welcome to Elite. Enjoy those emotes. If you want to join as well, link in the description below. Come in. Appreciate that, man. Better than nothing. Hmm. Okay. Alright, let's get on out of here. This is Corey. We're here. Heading up the road to the main gate. Over Our camp now, son. We're coming. What about the enemy? They've been, uh, uh, neutralized. Uh, hold your position. Curry out. Come on. Damn, bro. He snapped, huh? She snapped. We brought up your bikes, Captain. Thought we'd save you the walk back. Oh, thanks. Hey, Corporal. So how'd I do? Did I pass? Pass? Well, you've been watching me all day. I figured this was what? Some kind of test. <laughs> no, nothing quite as formal as all that. As you can see, our pool of recruits isn't what it used to be. <laughs> yeah. Everyone's just coughing. <laughs> oh, yeah. You passed. Oh. You ready to meet the colonel? <laughs> yeah, sure. 
Where the hell not? Just ask him where the ring's from, bro. Just like in conversation. So say John, where did you serve? Before the shit went down. Hey, you know what an MRE looks like. You know how to recon an enemy position. You know, cover in advance, tactical maneuvers. So, where did you serve? Marines? Army? We try not to talk about it, you know? In first year out here, it seemed like anyone who used to wear a uniform had a target on their back. I, uh, I was in the Army, 10th Mountain. I did a full tour in Afghanistan. So how about you? Anyone who's ex-military has a, a certain bearing. None of your soldiers have it, but you do. Like I said, you got a good eye. I was in the Air Force 10 years, on a sack. There ain't no missile silos in Oregon. I was on vacation, believe it or not. I was lucky. Before SATCOM went down, I got hourly reports from across the country. You think it was bad out here? Everything east of the Mississippi was overrun within two days. Jeez. That's good to know. But well, we do have the same headlight. So, are you familiar with this area? Yeah, I grew up in a town north from here. Uh, it's called Farewell, you know it? No. Uh, it sounds like a fitting place to be living at the end of the world. <laughs> yeah. Is, Tell me is that it. the spot? Maybe you have been here before. Yeah, I've been here. Uh, a few summers back, me and my old lady, or my wife, we stopped by here on our honeymoon. You got a pick? Uh, of your wife, I mean. <laughs> Her name was Carrie. We were married 12 years when... Anyway, it was a long time. No. Show him pick of your wife, dude. Show him pick of your wife, man. It's like a friendly bonding moment. He's married longer than you. Look at his ring spinning in the bottom right. Just a reminder of what, what is it from? Who, why does he have the ring? It's been there the whole game, that loading thing. The whole freaking... Don't forget to hit that like button. The way. We're trying a social experiment here. We're going to try to hit 10,000 likes on this video. Hit that like button. Oh, flashback. Hmm. You know, I, I think this might mean keep out. Huh? Oh, no, no, that doesn't apply to us. Why? Because we can't read? Because we don't obey the law. <sighs> Speak for yourself. After you. Mm. <sighs> All right. <laughs> uh, you know, making me a co-conspirator, not very chivalrous. Chivalrous what? <laughs> no, it means, um... <sighs> right. I never learn. <laughs> Honestly, got bodied. I'm sorry about that. Oh my god, you should have seen the look on your face. Oh, I bet it was funny. Yeah, if I'd owned a cell phone, I'd have taken a picture. Well, for just this once, I'm glad that you don't. Oh, come on, don't start on that again. Hey, I didn't say anything. You brought it up. You just did. Okay. Where are we going, sugar? So, where are we going? Just follow the trail. You'll see that it's not that far. They see keep out. But they don't got it barbed all around, man. They just got it barbed on one spot. I feel like even if you wanted to defend your land and you had that keep out sign... What would That'd my mom say huge if she out on a midnight stroll in the middle of nowhere with an outlaw biker? Oh, I don't know. She'd say, honey, you better wear your sweater. Very funny. Yeah, she wouldn't say anything, you know? You weren't supposed to tell them about us, remember? Oh, come on, Deacon. I said that a long time ago. You know I didn't mean that. Hey, look, I'm not judging. I'm just... I mean, I, just, I haven't told my old man. That's because your father's dead. Well, yeah, I mean, there's that. There is that. I mean, I didn't know that until now. They wanted to the drop that is, tidbit of information. You told anyone in the MC that you're dating a nice girl from Seattle and not some bimbo from whatever strip club you guys live in. 
Oh, whoa, whoa, oh, wait a second. No, we don't live in a strip club. I mean, we have a lifetime membership there. That's true, but we don't live there. And second, lifetime membership. Uh, I did tell them. Yeah, matter of fact, I did. Wait, you, you did? <laughs> yeah. Oh, come on, don't sound so surprised. They find your PhDs to be very sexy. <laughs> I bet. Cause I'm PhD, I'm dynamite. So he knows this way past my bedtime, right? Oh, I know. <laughs> Come on, stop. I mean, I really do have to get up early tomorrow. Yeah. Uh, how's that going? I mean, you. Uh, well, you never want to talk about it, so. It's nothing. It's just. Ugh, it's just this project, I and mean, we've got these execs flying in from New York to audit our progress, and the suits at our facility are installing a new lab without even showing me the spec, and. Ooh, well, I thought you didn't want to talk about it. Sorry, it's just... You know what, like I said, it's nothing. Anyway, thank you for dragging me away from I life. bet she started it. No problem. Her company started it, man. Tell me. I mean, like, it's obvious, right? Oh, wait, is this a pop card? Is this what you wanted to show me? Say what? Well, these are marijuana plants, and that's an irrigation system. So this here, this is a pop farm. Oh, hey, yeah, look at that. Pot farm. Well, you like flowers, don't you? <laughs> you dragged me up in the middle of the night to the middle of nowhere to show me the MC's illegal growing operation. Uh, yeah. I mean, you got me. <laughs> I was hoping that you could give us some tips, you know, cultivation. <laughs> put all those PhDs to work on something actually useful. Jesus, TQ, what? <laughs> okay, I get it. This is not actually what you wanted to show me, right? No, of course it's not. Come on, keep following the trail. We're almost there. That's pretty funny, though. Yeah, you think I would learn? You think I would learn, but I never learn. Nope. 10,000 fireflies literally right in front of my eyes. Oh, my God. God look at that moonlight. It is it's so beautiful. Holy smokes. Uh, we're almost there. You ever wonder what it would be like if just everywhere all at once the lights went out and everyone could just see the world just like this? What, you mean like all dark and shadowy and depressing? I mean the moonlight, the wildflowers, the fireflies. Oh, I see you were hitting again. Okay. Oh, look you at the moon. I just saw a shooting star. I take everything seriously. Oh, yeah, right. I do. You do not. Like when I suggested moving some of my stuff over to your place, you pretended that I was joking. Uh oh, -uh, no, that's not true. I pretended I didn't hear you. There's a big difference. You should have seen the look on your face. And you know, I do have a cell phone and I took a picture. You want me to show you? My God, you're a scientist. Can we be rational about this? Okay. First of all, all I said is that we should think about moving in together. You know, because we'd get to spend more time together and, you know, take the next step. What's irrational about that? I have a toothbrush at your place. Oh, I'm so sorry. You know what? You're right. That is a huge commitment. Well, I mean, do you know how much a good oh. toothbrush costs? Okay, see, there you go again. Every time I try to talk about our future, you turn it into a joke. Okay, all right. We do need to talk about it, and we will talk about it, but just hold on for a oh second. Oh, my I'm goodness. Gonna... I want to show you something, okay? See? This is why I brought you out here. Darn, dude. That's beautiful. Wow, how beautiful. Was it worth it? God, yes. <laughs> hey, there's something I've been meaning to ask you. Yeah? <gasps> Deacon? Will you... Will I? <laughs> so that a yes? On two conditions. Name them. Okay, well, the first one is that we don't have one of those biker weddings where you say that you're going to ride me as much as your bike. Done. I couldn't promise that anyway. Oh, stop. Okay, the second one. The second one is that you never leave me. Done. God, did you just break your biker ring on my finger? Uh, you know what? <laughs> I think I probably Ooh. did. That's too cute. 
It's too cute. <laughs> Look at it. It's so cute with its little fangs just like clenching onto the chain. You know, nothing says true love like dog skulls. Dog skulls. <laughs> <laughs> hey, what does it say there? Oh, I'm sorry. I thought you knew Latin. Come on. Uh, it's Morier Invictus. <laughs> it means death before defeat. Wow, I like that. Well, you're gonna get me like a real ring, though, right? <laughs> no, that this one's no, not absolutely, great. Absolutely, because I, I just you know, thought that's my ring. You right, it's your that. ring. Right. Something more simple, without things. Okay. <laughs> All right. <laughs> oh, shit, I'm sorry. No, yeah, it's your ring. It's the lab. I gotta get it. Okay. <laughs> Hello. Yeah. No, no, no. It's fine. I'll be right there. Okay, bye. Is everything okay? I don't know. They need me back there. What? I gotta go. Uh, th this minute? Like, th this time of night? I'm sorry. I have to go, but I promise I'll make it up to you. Okay. Come on. Honestly, the craziest part about the scene is that she has freaking reception out there, man. I don't get reception when I'm in an elevator. This girl has a reception in the back country beside a waterfall. For real, right? <laughs> yeah, no, I have no doubts in my mind that her company created the zombie apocalypse. I mean, it's just, if it didn't, they wouldn't be talking about it that much. So, she probably, I don't know, why didn't she tell us though? She'd be like, yeah, we created a zombie. I don't know. I'm not saying that's it. That's my guess though. That's my guess. Show him your wife. Show him your wife. His name was uh, Beth. No, I don't have a pick. Let's go. Well, he knows you're lying, bro. Your eye probably twitched a bunch of when you're lying. Come on now. Again, I'll read all super chats at the end of the stream. Appreciate everyone who uh, came through on that reel. What is this? Oh, bro, what is this? Oh my superior mace, bro, what it? Oh my gosh, this thing was crafted by the gods. This thing's dope. Not unusual, you know. I'm sorry. What's that? Do not have any photos of your wife, family. Yeah, why do you say that? Back in the day, everyone used smartphones. That's where we kept all our photos. When phones went away, when the cloud went away, our photos went with them. Yeah. yeah. I guess I hadn't thought about that. Same. My wife, Carrie. My father was a photographer. Old school. Dark room, chemicals, all that. Too stubborn to embrace the digital age, I think. If it wasn't for him, I wouldn't have any photos either. Yeah, well, I hated him. Cell phones, I mean. It seemed like everyone walked around with their noses buried in the damn things. I never owned one. Interesting. How'd you manage that? I worked as a mechanic. I, uh, I had my own shop. Probably had the last landline in Farewell. What's up, soldier? Ooh, look at... Okay. If we thought the other base was dope, look at this base. It has a moat. It has a moat. It has a freaking moat. All right, let's go meet the colonel. Colonel, if you will. Ah, you guys are taking this shit seriously. The colonel believes with enough motivation and discipline, we can achieve anything. Come on, hurry your ass up. I'm going as fast as I can. Just move it. Is that your idea of motivation? The colonel <laughs> set up a work camp on the south side of the island for those unfit to serve. Some of them require extra encouragement I'll bet come on follow me yes sir can't wait to see this colonel by some old dude oh hey oh that's the guy Stand up there with the others go 
Good luck, St. John. Wait, what? It's like a noose there. Got your ass too, huh? Whatever. Hey, man. It's good to see you again. St. John, right? Son of the preacher, man? Taylor, what's this son of a preacher, man? Shit, you keep saying... <laughs> I'm just kidding with you, man. Hey, do you have any luck? What? The, the woman you were looking for, you and your peeps are riding with. No. I need all your jewelry, watches, shit like that. Come on, in the bag. What? Sure, man, whatever you say. The hell you say? Recruits aren't allowed personal effects. The side shit's just gonna get stolen. Come on, cough it up. Oh, yeah, shit's gonna get stolen. Goddamn bullshit. Tin hot! Hello, Colonel. At ease. Visitors are not welcome here. You are here because you were invited, recruited by my trusted officers. When you answer me, start by giving me your name, last name first. Getting by, same as everybody. Name. <laughs> Atkins, Crystal, sir. How many men have you killed? Before or after? Answer the question. Fuck you! We have all done things that we're not proud of. Wait, who Survive recruited her? Stay alive. The Almighty understands this. The Almighty forgives Amen. this. Amen. But here, on this woman's face, are the footprints of Satan. Prison tattoos. Proof of what you once were and no doubt still are. It's people like her that are responsible for bringing the wrath Ooh. of the Almighty down upon us all. I don't know if this is going to end well for her. Take her to the work camp. What? Ah. You. Come oh, on, gorgeous. Let's goddamn go. redneck assholes. Get off of me! <laughs> Would she even be a good worker, though? You? I don't think she Taylor, wants to be there. Uh, wait. And, um, no, sir. I, uh, never been to jail. Never killed anyone, nothing like that. You've been in the shit for a long time. Yeah, I mean, I, I, know, I know how to shoot stuff. My, my dad took me hunting when I was a kid at, at a camp near Klamath Falls. It got. Just shut up, kid. And how about you, son? You know how to use a gun? St. John, Deacon. Yeah, I know how to use a gun. You're a drifter. Hold out your right arm. Tenth Mountain, Iraq, Afghanistan. Honorable service, and don't lie to me. I'll know. Served one tour, served with honor. Hated every goddamn minute of it. <laughs> well, shout not lie. Good man. <laughs> Hold up your right hand. Do you solemnly swear to support and defend the new constitution of these United States? Against all enemies. <laughs> I like the guy in the back's like. To bear witness and support Please. to the same. And to obey all orders without question. So, do you swear? I swear. Dismissed. Walk with me, son. The guy in the back's like, did I get recruited, or am I going to the work camp? Many recruits these days. He must think highly. You good, bro? Uh, I've been in the shit a long time. You know your way around the freaks? Yes, sir. I, uh, I know as much as anyone, sir. Good, good. In here. We'll have the doc take a look at you. I'm good, man. I got all my shots. I don't got worms. I ain't got rabies. I'm good. Trust me. Pulse is strong. Good heart rate. Got a pretty nasty burn there. 
How'd that happen? Uh, had a run-in with a wood stove. Wood stove, huh? Who dressed this? I did. No está mal. Not bad at all. <laughs> Thank you. Keep it dressed, or you're gonna lose that arm. You hear me, amigo? <clears throat> yeah, yeah, I hear you. I want you to check back with me in a few days. Got it. Well, Doc? He's fit to serve. Blara bien. You doing runs out in the ship? <laughs> Sorry, Doc. Uh, ya tiene novia. Uh, he's spoken for. Let me guess. The Wizard Island Witch. Vaya con Dios. Good luck, amigo. Let's go, son. Wizard Island Witch? What? I normally don't tolerate insubordination, referring to an officer as a witch. But I make exceptions for some of my more eccentric officers. Yes, sir. I make exceptions because every man and woman still living has a role to play. Do you believe in God, St. John? Never gave it much thought, sir. Well, it's high time that you did. He has a plan for us, all of us. And my part is this. Okay. Dude's uh, a little bit delusional, I think. He's created this whole thing around himself, sir. Kind of. We're all great. I don't know. We're gonna this have to see. Place. I have uh, a vision. He had a vision. Oh, nothing uh -oh. so grand as those described in the Old Testament. No flaming chariots or burning bushes. I simply woke up one morning before God's plague had rained down upon the world and knew that this was the place. Crater Lake, uh, Wizard Island. I call it the Ark. Are you familiar with the story? Yeah, I mean, yes, sir. I mean, everyone's, everyone's <laughs> heard of it. Indeed. You'd be surprised how few have read the Bible or the book of Revelations. You mean Genesis, Noah's story. I mean, uh, that, it's, it's the book of Genesis, sir. <laughs> yes, of course. <laughs> Wait, has he read it? He's like, yeah, yeah, of course. Look, they have their own banner okay, and stuff. Okay, son, let's get you squared away. Whatever you say. Now... We don't have much in the way of uniforms, I'm sorry to say, but uh, I think that... Uh, oh, here. Try this on. I like my hat. Seems to fit. I'll take that. Well, if you don't mind, this is a gift from an old friend. An old friend? <laughs> Not many of those left anymore, are there? No, there are Okay, soldier, but I don't want to see you wearing it. You're one of us now. And normally, we start new recruits in the rank of private. But since Captain Curry has vouched for your experience in the field, we are starting you out at the rank of corporal. Corporal? Congratulations, son. Thank you, sir. You got an armband, a new hat? Do some work. He's like, what am I getting myself into? All right. Now, what oh, we look different. Uh, you were telling me about the Ark, sir. Yes, the Ark. What you see here is only a small part of it. Behind us is a whole network of caves and vents that lead from here up to the Cone's Peak. When our work is complete, they will be filled with thousands of seeds, plants, computer files, and books. The world may die. But our achievements in medicine, science, and technology will not die with it. No, sir. That's pretty cool. Look but at the, the camp. Is more than just an arc, Corporal. It is a stronghold, a fortress. Here at the North Gate, we are stockpiling enough munitions to take the fight to the freaks. We have rifles, grenades, heavy machine guns, and RPGs. We have the equipment to make ammunition, every type. Every Ooh. Caliber. Okay. That's good news, honestly. This is our mechanical engineering area. If you need your bike repaired, see the officer on duty. Sir, uh, I hear somebody snoring, and as sir. As you can see here, courtesy of the old National Guard, we are building a fleet of trucks and other vehicles. Once the hordes are cleared from the highways, we will begin to rebuild the roads and bridges. Your slash and burn strategy may stop newts and swarmers, but it won't clear the highway. It won't, it won't stop the hordes, sir. 
We are aware, Corporal. The Hordes. The Hordes are a different beast entirely, aren't they? But we have a plan. Ooh. Okay. Plan, sir? Benjamin Franklin once said, by failing to prepare, you are preparing to fail. We are not going to fail. Okay, fair enough. What what's the, what's the plan, huh? You gonna tell the me the plan? The heart of the army lives here at the gate, ready to move on my command. These tents house hundreds of women and men, just like yourself, who have pledged and sworn their lives to the fight. But I have something else in mind for you, an assignment that requires more than just the ability to survive in the shit or use a gun. Are you up for it, son? Okay, uh, I guess yes, sir. So. Wherever you need me. You asked how we were going to defeat the Horde? Let me show you. Ooh. Okay. A lot of walking in this mission. Bro, if he's got a room full of dynamite, he's my dude. Whoa! Now! Shit! You okay, Lieutenant? Oh. Hey, Colonel. Sorry about that. Too much acetone in that batch. Lieutenant Weaver is our chemical engineer. He's working on new ways to, to blow shit up. Defeat the enemy. I'm sorry. But I like him. Uh, name's Weaver. James. St. John, Deacon. All this militia shit's just for show, right, Colonel? Corporal St. John is new to Corey's unit. If you need anything from out in the shit, he's your man. Oh, shit, yeah. yeah there's a couple of things I need. What are you working on? Oh, just the new gelling agent combining naphthenic and palmitic acid. You working on napalm? <laughs> napalm? <laughs> yeah. This dude knows his shit. Uh, just a lucky guess. Uh... <clears throat> Sorry to interrupt. Oh, any time. Oh, Colonel. I'm getting real close, Colonel. Very close. That's good. That's really good. Where are you going next, Colonel? Wizard Island Witch? That'll be all, Lieutenant. Who is this Wizard Island Witch? She's got a <clears throat> she's got a reputation that precedes her. Let me apologize for my more eccentric officers. No need, sir. That dude's we my favorite. One final stop. As much as I believe in Lieutenant Weaver's work, what you're about to see could be, I think, our path to victory. All right, what is this? Ma'am, I got everything on the requisition form. Does this look like fabric softener? No, ma'am. Okay, why don't you read it? <sighs> Active ingredients. Chlor chlor chloroform and uh, a turp turpin tur Get out. Shit. Get out! I can't do this if I have to do my own supply runs. I got it covered. Lieutenant Whitaker, this is Corporal St. John. He's a new member of Corey's unit. He's got some experience out in the shit. Read this. What? Read this. I mean, you can read, can't you? Active ingredients, chloroform, aterpenol, benzo alcohol, halothic acid. Good enough. When can he start? Ah, oh, I'll leave you to it. Carry on, Lieutenant. Leave us. Sir. Stand at attention. You're dead. You're supposed to be dead. Hey, hey, hey. hey. You're dead. It's okay. You're dead. I'm right here. Wait. Wait a second. I, 
I don't understand. I couldn't I find you. I thought you had died, and I, uh... No. We were overrun. Who's overrun? And we had to go south. We... Nero, they yeah, said Nero. that no one no, made I it out. Ryan, and I Farewell found was way. overrun. They said that everybody was mountain. dead. And I didn't think that... I never thought I would see you again. See you again. Hey, listen, now we can ride out of here. We'll pick a direction. We won't look back. Come on. No, no, Deacon. I can't. Are they, are they forcing you to stay here? No, you don't understand. We're fighting a war. Don't you see? This is a war that we can win. I ain't coming here to fight a war. I can be helpful. I can make a difference, but I... I can't go with you. I have to stay here. Don't you get it? You, you can stay here with me. Help me. Yeah. Look, afterwards, whatever you say, we, we, we can go wherever you want. <clears throat> Colonel's looking for you. Whatever you say, ma'am. Wait, wait a second. Your requisition form. Thank you, soldier. Oh. Bro. That's a uh... Woof. Okay, so I was scared that she was going to be like full on weird, but no, they definitely recognize each other, of course. And they still love each other. It's just like, there's a lot more backstory to her. And she's definitely toughened up. Oh my goodness. There's a lot we don't know about her right now. So, it's just a weird scenario too. Because nobody knows that we know each other. And he's kind of told a lie to get to this point. So, we're going to see how this evolves. I'm so glad we got her though. We got a health cocktail. We got a, I remember. Wizard Island. Sarah, can we come back? I miss you. I miss you, babe. Please open the door. Oh, man. I'm so glad she's alive. Corporal St. John to Lieutenant Weaver. Come back. St. John to HQ. This is Weaver. What can I do for you, Corporal? Uh, your requisition form says you need mer mercury. Oh. Any idea where I can get it? Yeah, sure. I should have written that shit down for you. It comes from, uh, Cinnabar. Corey's unit scouted out of mine north of Diamond Lake. Head there, radio me when you arrive. Yes, sir. Hey, between you and me, if the colonel isn't around, stop with all the yes, sir, no, sir bullshit, all right? <laughs> I like him. Go up. All right, hey, let's do a gun. I haven't seen you around here before. Name's Jacob <gasps> Everybody calls me D. St. John, Deacon. So, uh, you're the guy to come to for hardware? You got it, pal. You need guns? I got guns. If I don't have it, it was never made, you know what I mean? Uh, great. I'll keep that in mind. They got some guns here. Oh, they got a deagle! Oh my, where? That's it. That's it. I've decided. No, where, huh? No, hold on. I'm, I'm tossing in all my bounties here. That's hey. it. I'm uh, new around Sell here. All. My name's Deacon St. John. Pleased to meet you. I'm Ella. Corporal, take care. Corporal, take care. Corporal, what do you need? And so can we I upgrade our bike here too? Oh, this guy's got a cool yeah, welding mask. Oh. My name's Caleb. Caleb Tomlinson. Deacon St. John. Yeah, I, I just rode in. Oh, cool, man. Hey, listen, if you need something for your ride, you come see me. Between us, Lucas, the Canuck over at Diamond Lake, he'll rip you off, man. Great. Well, keep that in mind. Bro, that'd be great if you actually sold anything. Like, he Come doesn't sell in. anything. Take a look around. You don't sell anything, dude. Later. Okay, so I definitely want to get those weapons, without a doubt. The kitchen. Ooh. Sell all. That's it. All right, so we gotta go do this mission here. 
Um, we'll do one more mission. I'm just gonna head to the bathroom real quick. All right. What I want you guys to do while I'm gone is see how many likes we can get. All right. Our goal is to hit 10,000 likes for this video. I'm sure a lot of the likes will come after the stream, but if you want to help out for that goal, hit that like button real quick and make sure you subscribe if you're new around here. I'll be back in a second. I want you guys to let me know in chat what game you want to see me stream next. Okay. Just let me know in chat. I'm curious. Be right back. All right, I see a lot of GTA, Ark, Black Ops 4, Fortnite, Rage 2, Red Dead Redemption 2, Days Gone Part 8. Oh, you guys like the Days Gone, huh? I love this game. This game is dope. I will have to figure out what I'm streaming next, but appreciate all the suggestions. World War Z, Crew 2, Ark. Corporal. How am I supposed to get up there? Right, let's grab our bike. We'll ride up there. We're going to do one more mission here. One more mission. And then we'll have to save the rest for the next part of Days Gone. This game is getting extremely interesting. I mean, it's, it's been really, really fun so far. But the story has taken a kind of a turn. An exciting turn. And I'm excited to see where it goes to from... Uh, it goes to from here, rather. Man, they've got a hell of a base here, though. You gotta admit. I love how it's called Wizard Island. Look how huge the map is in this game. It's nuts. Wizard Island. Okay. I tried to turn it as much zombie credit or zombie like bounties and and like flowers and and meat, but it's not enough to even get rank one yet. I want to get those weapons. The weapons look sick. I've heard that the Tommy gun is one of the best in the game, so I want to grab that for sure. Hello, Corporal. How are ya? I want him to radio Boozer as well, for sure. Corporal St. John, is it? Yes, sir. Come in. Just enjoying a cup of tea, herbal, courtesy of uh, Lieutenant Whitaker. Would you like to try some? It's very good for the digestion. Uh, no, sir. Thank you, sir. I'm, I was just looking for the duty roster. I have an assignment for you. Men, Corporal. Not that they deserve to be called that. They've taken one of ours. Lieutenant Justine Norwood, a fine officer. And they have her, so, uh, yes, I will get her back, sir. With the help of men like you, we're going to take back this world. Power to the people, man. Dismissed. Bro, look at that weapon on my back. Oh, look at that trust. That's a lot of trust. Alright, we're making some money now. Seriously, though, that weapon's like... 
I've got another job for you. Come to the Diamond Lake outpost. Copy that, Captain. St. John out. Hold up. Turn to Diamond Lake camp? Mother trucker! The heck is this? Leave all that by the door. Oh, okay. What the heck is this? Bro. Okay, we're not going to go there yet. Let's go to this one. And then we'll do the one side. We'll just do the one mission, I think. Man, it like pains me because like... I don't know. I, I want to do the side quest, but like, I feel like if I'm calling it a walkthrough, people just want to see the main story. So I want to know, do you want to just see the main story or do you want side missions? So, so main, if you just want to see the main story, type that or side, if you want to see both main missions and the side story, let me know. Hey, this is Corey's unit. Open the gate. So this is another camp. Do they sell weapons here? Howdy there, Corporal. Or they don't sell Get weapons here. here. Name's Ava Bergstrom. Friends call me Bergy. Hey, Deacon Bergy. St. John. Yeah, I, I just got here. Well, Deacon St. John, you do your job, and we'll get along just fine. Okay. That? Please don't hurt me. Um, Sarge. I, ha I haven't seen you. Oh, yet. look at this. L Lucas Monroe. So yeah, this guy sells in, you know. upgrades uh, to the bike, and the other oh, camp sells uh, the upgrades to I, I got all kinds of bike weapons and stuff. If, it if seems like yeah, I, don't, I ain't got credits, bro. So you can get quite a few upgrades here. Oh, a radiator. Ah, let's buy it. Was there anything else that was super cheap? Oh no, these are hella expensive. Oh, that's cool. And then is there Oh, there's new visual parts too. Oh, we can make our bike look dope. Alright, we're gonna have to come back here later when we have credits. Creditos. Corporal, good. I have a job that requires your unique skills. Uh sure, yeah. Uh yes, sir. You remember Vasquez? The man that went AWOL. Yeah, we tracked him to the logging camp. I remember. Well, this man. Sergeant Lee Anderson was his partner. He was about to be arrested when he killed a guard and took off. Oh, your men have quite the code of honor. Our men? You're one of us now, remember? I've marked the location on where he was last seen on your map. Apparently, like Vasquez, he wasn't alone. Great. All right. So we unlocked a few missionitos here. Are they all side quests? Oh, that's definitely not a side quest. Keeping souvenirs. Wow, we got a lot of different missions here. Uh, let's refill our gas. Corporal, uh, what can I get for you? So expensive to refill the gas. All right, go to the lost cabin mine. What's this mission for? It doesn't really even tell me what it's for, but we're gonna do this one real quick. All right, so this is a brand new world. I we have, I don't think we haven't seen a zombie. Well, we saw the horde, but besides that, we haven't really seen any zombies, right? Uh, Saint John, Port Burrell, Saint John. <laughs> you got your ears on, man? Hey, this this thing didn't work. Yeah, your radio works. What's up? Deacon Saint John. Hey, uh, I mean, you know, nothing. It's just. <laughs> Let's check it in on you. I haven't seen you since the old swearing in thing. That was some shit. <laughs> Taylor, you know, I'm kind of busy. <laughs> hey, hey, what, what, the, what the hell you, you got, they got you doing? I'm, I'm in the damn infantry or some shit. Spend all day burning out nests, chopping down trees, hauling wood. So, sorry, sorry what, are you, what are you doing? Research. They got me going out into the shit, finding supplies for the officers, working on... Oh shit! Oh, I heard about that. Yeah, yeah, working on uh, on uh, bio weapons, uh, chemical weapons, shit like that. Burn them freaks to the ground. Am I right? <laughs> yeah. Look, Taylor, I gotta go. All right, all right. Hey, um, hey, 
look, man. He just wants a it's, friend. Uh, it's just I'm 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 having second thoughts about all this military shit, you know. Ah, Taylor, what radio are you on? Are you sure that you're not being monitored? Oh shit! <laughs> oh huh. snap! That's what I thought. Gotta go. St. John out. Lieutenant Weaver, you there? I'm at the mine. Good, good. Okay, man. You take a look around. The report I saw listed ore testing kits. You're gonna need one. <laughs> ore testing kit. Copy that. Uh, Cinnabar is kind of red, but not shiny. It'll have a dull luster to it. It's gonna be hard to miss. Test the ore. It's gotta be at least 60% pure, or I can't use it. 60% right, pure, it. you say? Testing kit. Where the hell am I gonna find an ore testing kit? Maybe Here's somebody riding. These, uh, shacks. Ah, One of these baby shacks. Do 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 baby shacks. Do I have? Let me see if I made all the bandages. Yeah, I'm good on those. If I can make med kits, I'd be fine and dandy. <laughs> Can't go through there. Let me just slide in here. There we go. There's a lot of ammo here. Holy smokes. What is this I see? My dude's freaking losing it. There we go. War testing kit. Yeah. What the heck do I use this? Okay, it kind of scares me that there's like a billion ammo. Right? Freak anybody else out? There's a reason. We got a billion ammo. Oh, we do have a skill point. We have two skill points. So we already, like, maxed out the fighting one here. Um... I think we continue to do ranged, although we're kind of increasing the amount of meat gathered from animals, reduces cooldown on stamina recovery. I think that one's really good. Outlines enemies in survival vision. That one's really good too, because we can kind of look through walls. What do you say, chat? I mean, a lot of these are good. I just want to see headshots, kills, recover health, increases projectile. Honestly, the headshot and this one, those are both really good. Um, I actually think the stamina one's probably the best. I'm gonna do both of these. So now we re recover stamina quicker, and now we can see them through the walls. Dope. Okay. Let's push this out of the way. Let's uh, investigate what this says over here. <clears throat> Lost cabin mine, the gold mine. Oh, this is nice. This isn't creepy at all. Very welcoming. Okay, okay. What did he say? Red rock, doll luster, cinnabar. Yeah. And now I just gotta test it. Nice, this will work. I hear motorcycles. Uh, do I want to? Oh, shoot. Baby shark. Good night. Stupid zombies. Stupid zombies got bodied. See if his pump is working. All right, y'all gotta calm down, okay? Just gonna get some cinnabar. Okay, 
Let's test you out. Come on. Oh, yeah, you'll do. All right, I gotta look around. Find some more. I'm all about collecting Cinnabar. You don't even understand. I'm a Cinnabar genius. Jenny's out of gas. Jenny's always out of gas. Well, fuel can. I'm gonna fill Jenny up. Oh, that doesn't sound right. Oh, here we go. Jug lug lug lug. Jug lug lug lug. Jug lug lug lug. Good. There we go. I don't have to use a flashlight anymore. I can see him through the wall, right? Oh, shoot. Oh, I know there's a bunch of little dudes over there. They're freaking me out, man. Y'all are freaking me out. Man, I love this stick. The stick of death. Ooh, let me pick up some of that. Gunpowder. I'm sorry. Oh, I yeah, you dead. You go along with him. Thank you. Thank you. Next. Here's some more. Come on, Laura. Let's see how pure you are. It's kind of nice that you can see him through walls. Yeah, you'll do. Yeah, almost enough. Oh, it's more black cinnabar. Here's some more. Gotta collect two more. Okay, let's test you out. Samples is all I need. It says that there's. Uh, oh, can't even. Here we go. Cinnabar. Oh yeah, that's a bloody cinnabar sample. Just pure enough. Testing. Just one more. Okay. Oh, we gotta go through this little side thing. How on earth do I get there? Uh, hello? This is not the right turn, sorry to interrupt you. My bad. Where on earth is the center bar sample? I am confused. It's probably very obvious. It says it's in this area. Uh, it's right here. Didn't I get this? I swear I got it already. All right. Elevator shaft. Oh god damn it. Wonder where this goes. Only one way to find out. <laughs> I would not do this. Come on, man. This is not a good idea. Like 
Get that. We you would want to leave. Uh, what's up here? Another tunnel. Looks like this one was abandoned a long time ago. Great. No, 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 no. I don't I do not want to trade that. Gosh, this is bright. Lieutenant Weaver, this is St. John. I've got the cinnabar you asked for. St. John, good, good. I'm almost ready for it. I'm, oh, hold on a sec. Can I help you, Lieutenant? Weaver, I ran out of isopropyl alcohol. Do you have any? Yeah, I got a bottle of vodka back in my tent. Stop by later. Jesus, you never give up, do you? Oh. Don't be such a stranger. Fuck off. <laughs> St. John. <laughs> yeah, sorry about that. Anyway, yeah, just drop off the oil as soon as you can. I got some more shit I need you to get. Weaver out. A narrow beacon? In here? What the hell? An injector. Nero had all Ooh. the good shit. Okay, I want to put one to health. Let's see what's up. Ah! Uh, Twenty-five health. Uh, micro recording. Huh? Jesus, that's a big guy. Yes, yes it is. Field note two zero seven two. We are at site sixty-nine. The where are we? The lost cabin mine. Thank you. The lost cabin mine. We have euthanized a specimen of Homo sapiens mutans corporosus using ten thousand milligrams of ketamine. A lot of ketamine. Note 2071, where 6,000 milligrams was barely enough to subdue the Homo sapiens mutans albino. We tracked this subject from its primary habitat and structures on the northern rim of Crater Lake. The northern rim, eh? What used to be the visitor center to this mine. Currently, we have no working theory as to the subject's migratory. Living patterns or how about why it's so goddamn big? Got any theories about that? <laughs> yeah, as a matter of fact, we do. Really? Yeah. Blood tests have shown that Homo sapiens contains corporosis with extremely elevated amounts of anabolic steroids. Corporal Deacon St. John. So, what? <laughs> hey, before they became infected, man. they were hey. roided out? Hey, Basically, what yeah. do you need? They were all body holes. Uh, Rastered out of sticks to legal. I got a secure channel and everything. So how's it going, man? Some probably high levels. Taylor, I'm busy right now, so... Yeah? What's that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I can literally tear you in half. Hey, come on. So, words on the camp... There's like eight audios going on right now. ...the colonel's nose. It's good stuff, too. But do you know anything about that? I don't do drugs, Taylor. So, no, I don't know anything about it. Why? No, 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 no. I don't either. I'm just... I saw this guy. You know, one of the new recruits acting all suspicious. He writes in and out of camp all the time, and so I thought, I thought I'd follow him, right? <laughs> Let's see what the hell he's about. Ah, oh, God damn it. Taylor, listen to me. You just go to Corey, let him handle it. You got that? Yeah, 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 yeah. That's a good call. Yeah. Okay, Mr. <laughs> St. John, I'll, uh, I'll talk to you later, man. Yeah, I'm out. Me? Wow. Jesus Christ. Oh, it's a bloody deer out here. Why would there be deer here? I can't even... Why do I still get this guy's signal? Hungry little guy? Oh god. Doesn't look good. Chow, what do you think? Is this thumbnail material? 
This might just be thumbnail material chat. Everybody hold on. We're going in. Okay. I like the little square there too. Actually, I wish it didn't appear. Okay, we got that. I'm gonna put on some jacked aperture. Like you can hide Deacon. You can change his face, look at that. He's like, hey, oh no, there's a zombie. All right, there we go. I'm hiding my face. We're getting this thumbnail chat. Wait. If you guys see that little square thing on thumbnail, you guys can't say anything, okay? Okay, let me let me go ahead and full screen preview this. Screenshot it. All right, we Gucci. We Gucci chat. We did it. If only we could get that thing away. Now I can Photoshop it out if I put it like here. Dah, it's too much work. Just kidding. Oh shoot, you're still alive. Yeah, I hope I'm feeling the pain. Who fucking is it? Well, fucking Jesse Carlos Williamson. Rest in peace. Cleanse our minds. All right, what's this? There you are. What am I following? I don't get it. Oh. You know, I'm collecting these just so I get more points. This is it. The controller is vibrating. Something like. Oh, right here. What do we got? You're mine now. Who is he tracking? This is the the exact same way to camp. Murderers and thieves, the lot of you. How many people you killed today, huh? Oh shoot, is this a camp? My bad, my apologies. Is this a Marauder camp? I got help, you. I need help right here. Help. Sh shut up and I'll help you. Sorry, bro. Oh, that is a long rifle. What you got there? Oh, shoot. I'm sorry, lady. Oh. Good night. Oh. Oh, keep rolling, 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 rolling. Oh, she kind of just stop. I'll be back in a second. I just got to do my thing. Honestly, they're all getting bodied. I got one more. Look at this guy. He didn't hear nothing. He's like, oh, that's just Susie and Jack going all crazy. How about this, mother trucker? I just snapped his rib cage. And I got a flower. All right. 
I'm gonna save your butt. Hey, hey, hey. It's okay. You're not gonna make it out here. I know where there's a camp. What? What camp? It's a camp? Where? Yeah. Where? You Show need to me. go to. I'll go. Oh, shoot. Chat. Wizard Island. Right? I want the guns. We're going to Wizard Island. Okay. Look, head to Crater Lake. There's a militia camp on Wizard Island. You gotta find Colonel Garrett. Oh, man. Thank you. Thank you. I was done for. Holy shit! I was, I was a goner, you know? Yeah. Woo. Thank you so much, man. Thank you. Thank you. Tell him yes. it's Deacon. Deacon St. John. Keep your head down and run. Keep your head down and run. I'll tell you what. Get back to our bike. We went on a bit of uh, off the beaten path there, huh? There's a camp right beside them. You think we should tell them? Honestly, we should just collect these and give it to our wife. She'd love that. She's like, oh, I love flowers. I'd be like, yeah, you do. O'Brien is a real one. O'Brien helped out a lot. Yo, thank you everybody for 5k likes while live on Days Gone. That is nuts. Big shout out to everybody. If you haven't already, do be sure to hit that like button. We're trying to go for 10,000 likes on this part of the walkthrough. And if you're new around here and this is your first time tuning in, would love if you hit the subscribe button. See you again in chat. That'd be dope. And if you guys donated, I will read them at the end, okay? I don't want you to think that uh, I forgot. I'm just going to read them at the end. It's typically what I do for walkthroughs. Advice, Cope Snap. Assume that everyone is just lying their asses off. Is that about it? So, no, that's that's that is. Does this look cool, Chad? Chad, is this a better thumbnail? Chad, I'm all about thumbnails, man. That's pretty sweet, right? I don't know. I'm gonna think about it. I might change this uh, thumbnail up. The one that we got right now. The problem is you can't even tell what it like is. All right, it. that's pretty good advice. It's a little late, but it's good advice. Maybe if he's on the bike, it would look more. Shit. Eh. Let's turn in this quest. All right, I got your stuff. Lieutenant. <laughs> nah, man. Leave that shit by the door. No, 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 no. I mean all that army shit. Yeah. Oh. Okay. Uh, <clears throat> I think that's what you were looking for. All right. Yeah. yeah this is great. Hey, let's wait a second. Here. Polystyrene. Yeah, you know, like white foam coffee cups, packing peanuts, shit like that. Yeah, got it. Hey, man. By the way, how did it go? With the Wizard Island Witch? You mean Lieutenant 
Whitaker. Man, I thought you were gonna leave all that shit by the door. That'll be all, Cole. Ooh. That'll be all. That's my wife. That's my wife. That's my wife. You need something? You got something to say about it? Ooh, got some bounty targets. Got a new skill point. Man, we are leveling up a ton. We just leveled up these two. Give an extra burst of adrenaline when low on health. Increases inventory space for crafting components, traps, and throwables. There we go. So now we can hold a lot more. Alrighty, chat. We're almost ranked up in the Wizard Island camp. Which is good news because if we rank up, hey, we get access to some dope weapons like PPSH, the, the, the Chicago Chopper, aka the best gun uh, in the game, served with the guy from Long Island. some shotties, Accent's some old guns. Miss. No shit, right? Let me tell you, man. Before shit Deagle. went down, I used to run this website called You Need Guns, I Got Guns dot com. Oh, Jesus, holy shit. That's where I've seen you before. You had a. You had a cable show. Uh, my old man used to watch it back in the day. Hey, your old man had good taste. Goddamn right I did. I used to travel the country hitting up out-of-the-way gun shows, flea markets, shit like that. I, I guess this is about as out of the way as it gets. I guess it is at that, huh? I guess it is at that. All right, chat. I think that's where we're going to wrap up this episode here. Uh, we got a lot of missions to do like for real we got a lot a lot of missions to do we got this one we got this one and i think we got this one over here or maybe we don't but uh yeah we got to get to doing them it's pretty sweet out there's the southern part of the map which we didn't know existed so well, i'm sure we'll be able to go back to the northern part of the map but this part of the map right now is home and uh we're gonna keep exploring i'm glad we found our wife and i'm glad we're continuing the storyline here we're definitely gonna have to play more days gone maybe tomorrow Maybe tomorrow. Maybe we'll play tomorrow. I don't know. Uh, but if you did watch and enjoy this, would appreciate it if you dropped a like. Again, trying to hit 10,000 likes on this video. If you're new around here, hit the subscribe button. Very important. Um, so you don't miss out on future content. And uh, let's go ahead and read some of these super chats real quick as well. Don't forget, typical dot store. If you guys want to cop the glasses, they are back in stock. So if you want to grab yourself a pair, head on over to typical dot store and grab them before they're sold out. The hat's for sale too. We got socks on there now. We got uh, a bunch of cool stuff. So head on over to typical dot store. Link in the description below. Pick yourself something nice. And uh, if you guys want to send pictures, we might post them on the Instagram and Twitter for typical store, which is just typical store if you type them in on those. Uh, so yeah, tag typical store on Instagram and Twitter with your pictures and I will do my best to get them seen and hopefully post them up over there. So shout out to Sin of Agree TTV. Appreciate that. Glad you enjoyed the channel. Hint Hilder Dorf, uh, Jason Royal Lundy with the kind words. Thank you very much. Demo Adventures, Mad Cat Tari, Kyle Sipe. Love your live streams. Please keep on making more. You should play this with Samara. Hope you're having a great day. Kyle, thank you so much for that. This would be a great co-op game, but it is just single player. So no co-op for this game. Uh, otherwise, I would love to play with Samara. Ozum Wolf Boy, thanks for that. Mad Cat Tari. Did you keep me entertained with your gameplay? I love you. Thank you. I appreciate that. Glad it entertains you. And I'm glad you, uh, I'm glad you felt that way enough to drop some, uh, dono there. So thank you. Uh, Brittany Barnes, Rampage, uh, Get A Life. We have Julie Miller, Alex Herter, Julie Miller again. Thank you, Julie. Austin Alexander, um, Andrew Fletcher, Lane Froof, uh, Jason. We have, uh, Jemaine Lede, Lisa Davis with the five. Whatever, whenever I read Yayit in chat, I can only hear you say Yayit, I'm a sheep. Yayit, I'm a sheep. Yeah, I say that all the time. So thanks for that. Also, I did another makeup look to go with my fire merch. I will have to check it out, Lisa. You you killed it on the last one. And uh, thank you for your continued support. Lisa's a real one. Shout out to Lisa. Uh, Texas Beast 306. Thank you, Master Blaster. We have Gaiden YT. Glad you. This game is awesome, I gotta admit. Some people are like, bro, some people, I, I don't think it's people, I think it's more reviews that are hating on this game, but this game is awesome. I genuinely enjoyed it. The company's never contacted me. This is not sponsored. 
I'd recommend this game, and it's definitely got a lot of hours of gameplay uh, for me so far. There are some bugs, and if you don't have a PS4 Pro, apparently it runs pretty bad, so just a heads up. But again, unconfirmed, and uh, that's just what I heard. So, um, so we also got uh, Emperor Cobra. Just bought a pair of those glasses. Can't wait to get them. Here's to you, TG, for being awesome. Every stream, make me laugh every time. Emperor, you're absolutely going to love them. Make sure to send me a picture uh, or tag typical store on Instagram and Twitter if you if you get them and want to post a picture. Shout out to you and uh, glad you enjoy the streams. That means a lot. Uh, Candice Lafayette, glad you enjoy this game. Enjoy it too. Blitz Gaming, dropping flames. What the hecky? Why does Iron Mike's house look like the Modern Warfare 2 map house? It does. Dude, you're totally right. It does. That's where it looked familiar from. Good good observation, bro. We have uh, Gilbert the Train. <laughs> Appreciate the love. He's been sub since GTA 5. He's been sub for a minute. Jake McCatterick. It's Braffy Miller. Megatree Paul. Awesome Noodle Face. Thank you for the very kind words. Do my best. Dragonborn Gaming. Keep up the great streaming. Hope you and Samara are doing great. Sending some good vibes and blessings your way. Peace be with you. Peace be with you also, my friend. Appreciate that. I will let Samara know you said hi. And thank you for the very kind words, my friend. I mean, these messages all make my day. Just so you know. You guys don't have to dono. I read chat just as much as I read the donos. And uh, I appreciate the kind words. I really do. Ron Anderson. Being a corporal sucks. Hated the rank. Being an SSG was a little better. Loving the series. Dad had life. Were you in the military, Rob? That's nuts, bro. I didn't know that about you. I'm learning a little bit more about Ron every day. He's got the dad hat from Typical Dot Store. He, he's an awesome dude. Just shout out to Ron. Dark Souls Definitive 2.0. Dylan Cahoos has been watching for two years. Appreciate you. Monkey Gaming. Glad you enjoy it. And uh, JC the Gamer with the 10. Been watching since GTA Zion Mod. Then this this is probably the, the best thing we'll get to a GTA Zion Mod in its own dedicated game. So... Like I said, anybody that enjoys the GTA Zombie Mod series, this is the game walkthrough to watch. And then we have Zach Carrizo. I will be doing one more stream after this, and I'll let you guys know in a bit what that is. But on that note, that's going to be wrap for this one. Again, if you watch and enjoy this, hit the like button real quick. Subscribe if you're new. I don't want to sound like a broken record, so that's going to be wrap for this one. Typical dot store. Get yourself some gaming glasses before they're sold out. I'll see you guys in the next one. More days gone really soon, and I'll talk to you guys over on Twitter and Instagram. Again, links to everything in the description below. I'll see you guys later. Thanks for watching. Hope you have an awesome day and peace out.